Blouse. Yeah. I go home and post it. That's why. Go home and post it. Yeah. Like post post up this. Yeah, if y'all want. Oh shit! Why not? Why, why for not? What's the best time to make it work? Yeah. Um, <laughs> how long y'all usually wait? It was like just get out there, Eddie Kane. <laughs> right. How long y'all usually wait after y'all uh, record? Like we we normally record on a Sunday and drop like on a Wednesday. Like the audio will be. Of like what? Tuesday. Audio will be Monday. Yeah, audio will be, be Monday. Monday or Tuesday. We let the audio sit first. That's what you just used to listen yeah. to. Yeah, and audio the visuals sit we first. hit them with on um, like Wednesday. Yeah, we hit y'all with the visuals Wednesday, and uh, we don't give away a much to all the sauce because we live right now. Understandable. Yeah, but um, it's all it's all a process as they say. <laughs> Some Popovich shit. But um, this is a uh, what episode. 22? 22. Two, two, I ain't repping Emmett uh, Smith. I'm going to do the Rick Ross. Little mama super D. Smith trash. Say she 22. You say Emmett Smith trash. Ooh, a lot of good 22. Not top 10. Oh, here we Who go. top 10? Y'all be disrespecting Emmett Smith. Running back? Yeah. That's, Emmett a, Smith that's a list, though. Emmett Smith get disrespected. That's, yeah, that's a spooky list. No, that's a that. list, man. Uh, what? Uh, uh, top 10 list. running back list? Oh, that's spooky. I, I would have to look it up. OJ was yeah, really yeah, top yeah, 10. Yeah, we ain't got the time right now. Yeah. 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 You got to include yeah, all top 10. Depends your era. I think because it's highlight real trash. You think because it's highlight real trash? No, I just think his mixtape would be trash. He had an offensive line out the ass, you feel me? Nigga played 20 years. And his record never going to be broken on some bronze shit. Yeah. It's a lot of that offensive line. He got like 20,000 yards or some shit. That's retarded. Who scoring record y'all respect the most? Kareem's or LeBron's? LeBron, bro. Kareem and with no three points. Reason why I say Kareem, I, I asked this because Kareem's did it. He did it in a shorter time. He set that record. No, in a I actually shorter take time. that back. I respect anybody that was the fifties, sixties, seventies and had no three point line. Yeah. And, he got, and he got like twenty thousand. I'm a, yeah. I'm gonna say Kareem. Yeah, because no three point line. Um, and somebody had to pass on the ball. I'm gonna say Bron because his numbers <laughs> fell off. His numbers never fell off in a shorter time. You say his numbers, I, okay. You his numbers, numbers I ain't, but I don't want to sound I mean, like I'm hating on Brian. Kareem is the best three point shooter exactly all the time. So you like, saying I'm not hating on That's Brian. actually two different arguments. Because, like, you, you basically <laughs> he said his career, his he career was better from start to finish because he never fell off. Who? Come on, Brian. LeBron. But I think that's a different argument than nah, who nah. you respect the best. You know, he do be in the game in the full court to get points. We ain't going to talk about how many, it. Yeah. How many minutes in? <laughs> hey, hey, Tom, we're like five minutes in. Top 10 talks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh shit! What's going on with y'all though, man? This is episode twenty-two of the Couch Boys. How's everybody feeling, man? We got our cut my cousin here, West Dot. West, West. West, how you feeling, man? I'm chilling. Chilling. Feeling good. Feeling great. Yeah, yeah sir. Yeah. Mook, how about yourself, man? I'm feeling good, man. Yeah. Are we? Oh yeah, I'm sorry. We got these yeah special little cups here. I was gonna shout it out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. who made these cups, Drew? Who made these cups, Drew? <laughs> yeah, my girl got these. Made. You know, I thought your girl made this the whole time. Why you thought she made? I, it. I was just reading the messages too fast. You got the couch on the back. Yeah, he tried to discredit his girl. Like, no, nah, not discredit. I just, just reading the message. Yeah, I just didn't yeah. know. No, because why you reading the messages in the group? Yeah, chat because they got here. The I, can, I just got here right, that's and then I seen one. them. I was like, wait, did my girl get this? I'm like, y'all must have linked up and. He was like, nah, his mind was like, oh, okay. Nah, she she made it. I ain't gonna, yeah. I ain't gonna take the credit from him. Let's talk about how as soon as I said that, you was like, huh? Like your girl can't make no damn cup, man? <laughs> yeah, See, I did that. that. See, oh, I bro, got just did that. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga tried to start shit as soon as I go. Yeah, yeah I can't make no cup. Let's <laughs> 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 make episode come out. She on your ass. <laughs> Man, that shit, I go home. Life, uh, life is good though, man. Yeah, life is good. Take play. We had a uh, birthday that just passed too. I right, ain't even say nothing. Didn't even just go out on the weekend. That's yeah. not true. You did not say it was your birthday. That's not true. Do I got I got receipts? <laughs> no, no, this you didn't. Thing. I Drew got said it. Go, go ahead, go crazy. I got receipts. <laughs> this is the thing. Yeah, the thing. Drew one, said it I was, was what happening, y'all. It See? was his birthday. <laughs> right. The real is gonna be this conversation, and then the receipts gonna pop up. This is the thing. Bro, I'm about to shoot you bail. <laughs> Drew said it was it was his birthday a couple times. It was coming up. What I'm telling them is niggas is old and then niggas is doing stuff. So right. it's like we passed it was like, okay, yeah, Drew birthday. Then we started living our life. Then so we don't know. First of all, you got like three different pages that say it's your yeah, birthday. You got like Cook three, you got Zuckerberg <laughs> three times. So you got like fake yeah. Illuminati right. birthday. What time I wish you had one fake page. What time I wish you had Illuminati birthday, birthday on it though. Somebody posing as me then. I got uh, one fake I page. wish you had yeah, a birthday. You got three Illuminati pages. You got to right. show me. You got three. That's somebody, that's somebody, <laughs> no, you got two Illuminati pages. 
But you got two Illuminati <laughs> birthdays. Show me them. So you got Somebody three Illuminati birthdays, possible. Oh, I wish you had a birthday like a month That's ago. Crazy. He was like, "You yeah, my birthday? That ain't my Cash birthday." Yeah, I, nah, I remember that movie. We yeah. like, "Yo, happy birthday!" Yeah. Like, it ain't my birthday. That Illuminati <laughs> ass birthday. I got one birthday account. Cash apps. I got one KD account when I get blocked. Other than that, all these other two and three. I used to get blocked a lot. No, you said you was going. Yeah, you, you said a couple years my birthday, but the weekend. And then I said we going out on um, Saturday for me. Um, me, Scotty I thought birthday. you meant for J Motor. That's what I meant. I that was last was. week. See, I was with Scotty y'all uh, this this uh, was this weekend or Friday, whatever. Friday. Yeah, hey, you and Scotty got the same month, birthday month. Yeah, I think Scotty's Jay's the sixteenth, Scotty the eighteenth, mine's the twenty fourth. Um, yeah, happy belated, uh, uh, to Scotty too. Got, um, yeah, a couple of the. When was uh, J Mo birthday? The 16th, I think. Oh, man, you know me. One of them, 16th to 18th things is Scotty and Jay. Um, Jay Mo, that's, that's my man. We yeah, like we like me. Jamal yeah, Murray Shout and Jokic Weeper. on that spade table. When's birthday? Day 11? 11, okay. Yeah. Shout yeah. out to Weep. You the big, what, Fuller? Or... You know, that's why I ain't want to go there, but that's why we ain't hear nothing about it. That's why we ain't hear nothing about it. What? That's why, that's why we ain't hear nothing about it. We ain't hear nothing about it. That's why we ain't hear nothing about it. I think that's the main reason we ain't hear nothing about it. He got caught. Huh? Oh, the nigga hesitated right. about his own age. Proud nigga get no, no, 40, no, no, man. No, 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 no. I was going to say, 41 years young, baby, and I feel good. I feel better than I did five years ago. I ain't going to hold you. I did not know you was 40 already. Mm hmm. I ain't know that you shit. know what's funny though? I think girls celebrate their birthdays better than guys. We don't give see girls we celebrate everything better. Right? Than they don't care. They, Is it better? Than every birthday? Fuck up. They celebrate no, but they celebrate it more than we do. Like what you like? What Happy you doing for your birthday? Man, chilling, going out. That's it. Makes them happy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, they make a whole weekend out their birthday. Yeah. They make a whole month out their birthday. Too. A year. I mean, but as a guy, do we want to? Do you truly want to be like, yo, I'm doing something this weekend? It's my birthday. I say month. the older you get, I mean, you I mine kind of planned out. Me and my girl knew we was going to the comedy show Friday. Should I say a sassy to celebrate your birthday? No, I'm talking about, so I'm talking about every, like, because you know, some, some women do like a whole, a whole month. month. That's yeah. crazy. But like, having your weekend itinerary, that's normal shit. No, that's, that's like, I knew Friday, like, I knew Friday this. comedy show, Saturday yes. the homies, and Sunday was the family dinner. Right. Like, like man, I want to do, uh, like, a, a dinner with the guys, uh, probably some shit with some. You should say bitches. <laughs> no, I wasn't gonna say bitches, <laughs> but it was gonna be sex lined up. It was, I was gonna say you coochie know, at the end, like, you know, so you know, the end. right? Like, you say it. like top, like all right, dinner coochie, like fun again coochie, like chill Sunday coochie. If it's lined up on the weekend, gotcha. Yeah, you know, that's, I, I think, think that's as black man older we get celebrate your birthday, man. Oh yeah, you should. Hey, uh, Coke, are these oh, cups bro, in the shot it. good enough? Yeah, they're in. All right, cool. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Good, good. Um, all right, so we free balling, sort of, right? This show. Nah, we got to start off with that topic. No, I we got to start off with Justin Fields. The topic. Oh, I thought you was going to start off with the topic. I was. Topic. Then I thought, yeah, we. Because I think Justin the Fields reason why I'm see. saying that is because we going we could talk, talk about We're going to cook on that. Yeah, this one, Justin Fields, you know, R, not RP, but damn, that was kind of crazy to say that. But uh, it's over. His tenure. Is over. He is now playing for the team that Mook is sponsoring on his hat right now. Um, for what a six round pick, possible bag, four, six round, possible four, bag yeah. of chips, nine later. Yeah, a little piece of puffin' fries. <laughs> That's crazy. Didn't get no bustle with it. <laughs> so is it, is, it well, true that, burger. is it true they could have got better, but they doing him a favor because he wanted yeah. to go there? Yeah, they did him a favor. That's crazy. How you know? I think they're just saying that shit. Right, that's what I'm saying. I'm asking. I think that's a favor to go to Piss, the, all the places he could have went. Man, fuck, fuck Pittsburgh. Man. Man, you saying that, but he knows certain organizations that you get sent to is your ass. You done. It must have been. Saying, I'm yeah. not saying. Okay, I, I, New England, that's not a fuck bad up. place. Tom Brady you saying that now? Fuck, yeah, fuck but New England, certain organizations. <laughs> I'm good not going to. Do, do Justin Fields like black women? What? What, what the fuck? Uh, ask I'm not going to Boston if I like black women. I don't know. I I don't know. <laughs> you gotta I'm add going in the Patriots about like black women. <laughs> oh, they. Uh, they to change the whole What's closer around? All right, you got New York that's close, but still, I'm pretty sure Paul Pierce did. I in Boston. Wait, you, you, you don't think Boston got black people? Well, you got yeah, you got hella black do, people, but they got hella racist people. That's that's everywhere, cuz. No, all right, okay, but it's levels, right? Is nah, Boston up there? Yeah. They is up there. All right, then. So, so, so is bro, Bobby Brown from Boston. We're bro. from the crib, bro. Like, 
You say who from what? Too much Bobby Brown, Brown. No addition. What about a hood? But say Bobby Brown a hood, nigga. Benzino, nigga. Right. Benzino. <laughs> Benzino. Wow. <laughs> I'm just saying, man. Yeah, I love, I love, I love, I love okay, but look, we talking about rappers and singers. <laughs> from that, Justin Fields to Ben Z, We talking about rappers and singers that's in those neighborhoods. <laughs> he is going. He's he's like, like he's potentially taking. I don't care what Mac Jones did. That's still like Tom Brady sent over there. So when you like play, when, look, look. When Marshawn Lynch was in Buffalo, that's, he said ain't shit to do in Buffalo. They ain't love it right now. Ain't nothing. Well, I'm just my family. Ain't nothing to do with my walk. Yo, I knew that, that was facts. I knew that was facts when that nigga drove all the way here to watch a Bulls and Blazers game. That's bro. That's wild. Dang. 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 But we, remember we been to uh, Milwaukee. Three hours, that's three hours around. That's an hour and a half. If that. Yeah, if that. Really. It's I mean, not, I don't, back, I don't, from what I've from. seen, it's not for a famous person. That shit person. look like a, uh, it's not for a famous person. It's too congested in one's pocket and, yeah. <laughs> that shit look like a, a eight year old building a, a city with Legos. Hey, that's what I said about that's that shit was like all out of place. So yeah, Justin oh, yeah, Fields. Justin Fields. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to go off on some of the other shit when you said that. Yeah, Justin Fields. We I think he, had, I think he had, a, he had a good situation. Mm-hmm. Should have kept him though, low key. Why you feel like hey. we should have kept him, Wes? I feel like shit. We just got a whole bunch of weapons to go around. Them. Think it would have been perfect. Think we should replace the coach, but Eberflus. We'll see. And I think they put more pressure on the rookie court. He's going to have to go to the playoffs. If you ain't C.J. Stroud, like. He's going to have to. Yeah, he's going to have to go to the playoffs. With everything you got. And if they don't, you, the coach getting fired. Now you're going to bring a bunch coach. of shit right now. Did C.J. Stroud even have what he had? Tank Dale went down in the midst of his rise. No, he had him. I think he got him. And he took, he took my team but out doing the, the playoffs. Is the pick Caleb Williams, though? It'd be like the Bears, not to pick them. I yeah. think they they picking them. Man. They pick. They spend too much time. Yeah, they, yeah, you don't yeah. do that and not you pick them. Pick I won't be but, surprised. But they speak to Jaden Daniels, but to West, to West Point, they Somalian. <laughs> the Somalian fundraiser. Let's be real. Explain that. They yes. scammers. <laughs> <laughs> So they might, funny as hell. They, they might do some. But let's be real. <laughs> don't they know, a, I said it. I said it. I'm gonna let you rock, Moop. This is the worst sports franchise I ever witnessed in my life. Damn. In my life, 100. percent I've bears? never seen I agree. the Bears, Better than the Clippers. Yes, the Clippers. Yes, there's some bad organizations out there, bro. Bro, yeah, ain't nothing worse terrible. than the Bears, bro. Yeah, they terrible, terrible, what about what about New Orleans Pelicans? Hell no! You see what the team they got right now? It ain't about the team they but got that, right now. But they always do. go to waste. Like I can't say nothing worse than the Clippers, bro. What they what they Dallas to put that team through? If OKC messed this team, that's because of that. But that's because of that one <laughs> incident. You feel me? No, yeah. it's been since he got him. He don't pay his players. They don't practice. Bro, they was practicing at college. All right, but look, the moves he make was decent. Bears make dumbass decisions. What moves did Donald Sterling make? He that never look, paid his guys. He a draft him I mean, and let him go. I mean, he, okay, drafting. Yeah, he drafted because they, they always because they always was ass. That's why they in the lottery. Okay, because they had a bunch of young niggas. Nobody wanted to play for them either. You in LA? Yeah, you in L- That's why. Second team. They, they got the What's Lakers. the Bears' excuse? They the only team. They said their locker room was dark and shit that's what I'm saying. apart. He used to <laughs> like, well, you right, right. That's what I'm saying. He used to hit on this player. Go, go sneak. <laughs> Lakers playing tonight. All right, go in there. But no, nah, I think the overall, <laughs> overall thing. That's a bit. It come down to a business. That's what it, why Justin Fields not here. Because if he stayed, he would have to pay him. You got to pay that man. So he reset the quarterback market. You get the rookie. You still can make money. And let's be real. And they trying to get a new stadium. So they trying to have a new quarterback go to this new stadium, have a nice business. Nah, it's That's crazy as a bad fan to still be sold on that. Like, new quarterback, new stadium. I'm just saying it's a business. Well, let's talk about it. Justin Fields didn't play great. But I think we liked him because he was, like, kind of humble. So we kind of gave him a chance. The way Khalil is acting, if he play like Justin, he going to get killed. Yeah. But if he kill, the city going to love him. Okay, but with he that ain't got no choice to kill. Be or. But he ain't got okay, no choice to but, kill. But Who I ask you this, and I've been asking people this a couple of times when they when they criticize Justin Fields' uh, play. You name me a quarterback that's doing well and started well with a start like him. Offensive coordinator after offensive coordinator, new coach after yeah, he new get coach. A fair shake. Horrible, all, no offensive weapons. Like what was? Who starts off and just be? You're great like that. Right. I don't know. He ain't get a fresh shake. But if he was acting like Khalib, none of that even matter. I'm just saying his attitude, either he got to kill or not. Ain't yeah. no, he's not going to, even 
with he the help no he got, he's not gonna get no chance. Only person I can think of. A lot of pressure. Yeah, it's two guys in another sport I can think that's coming in a perfect position as a number one pick was Bass Johnson and Tim Duncan. And Larry Bird. He won a number one pick. Wow, she said number one. My fault. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> was it coming in with that attention? No, with the, the group. With the group. Oh, like, like already, already, yeah, already, look at the already weapons. decent. Yeah. Yeah, look at the weapons. Yeah. Yeah. You got a top 10 defense. You got now, that's what's up. It's like right, they, you they build give a quarterback all that. everything they need just to get rid of him. I'll be salty as hell. Yeah, I'll be blue. Yeah. I'll be like, that's why I wish um, them more losing. Fuck them. <laughs> nah, we big bears. It happened. <laughs> fuck them. Fuck them. Well, I, I think he had a good support of Mike Tomlin. Let's go, Khalil. Me neither. He better do well. That's how I was with the Cubs. I don't care for, like, baseball, but, like, if my, like, fans got to see them win, I don't care for, like, baseball, but, like, if my, like, family could get to see them win, yeah. I'm for it. You know, my thing I, is, I don't even win. We get to get out here too. Yeah, when the Cubs, yeah, I'm, won, a fake, I'm a fake yeah. Bears fan. Yeah. When, when the Cubs yeah. won, that's the happiest I've ever seen. Yeah. The city. Super Bowl, I'm collectively. Out here. Yeah. <laughs> Collect, when the no. Cubs won, that's the happiest I've seen. The city, no. nigga, that was happy you seen the nation. Right, yeah, like, like, bro, I was at the, the bar. Parade was five point yeah. five million people. I was at the bar when they won. That, that Everybody in Chicago's not a Cubs fan. Shout out Cleo. Shit, it doesn't matter, bro. More than the Bulls. Yeah, yeah, you tweaking. Are you yeah. tweaking? Yeah, bro. I'm tweaking. It's, no. it's more like hey, he said. Man. No, he said happy. He said he never seen the city this happy. I collectively, said, yeah. Collectively, collectively, man. We know the real yeah. rock with the Bulls. Yeah, nigga. The hood. Of course, if we see the Look, Bears win, that'd like be crazy. But we ain't seen whole, the Bears in our era. Yeah, as a whole, <laughs> the Bulls winning is like the Blackhawks winning. Let's keep it real. No, 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 no. We ain't gonna do that. I ain't even like the Blackhawks was was just as worse as the Cubs. Hear me out. Hear me out. Blackhawks was lit. Can I can I cook and then if I'm I'm wrong, y'all like nah. You already wrong though. This what I mean. When the Bulls win, who really happy, happy? What you mean? Everybody. No, I can't say that. Can't, I can't say that. The average You can't fan. say that, but who was really happy when the Blackhawks won? We was like, damn, they cold. A selective of- Take, uh, Go look at them pictures of those damn parks. Yeah. It ain't, talking it ain't to, the same. Okay, I'm probably the, the 2% it ain't, it ain't the same. black person Bulls that follow got everybody, bro. Thank you. I don't, you know Even what? people that wasn't basketball fans bro. was rocking with the Bulls. Because of Mike. Thank yeah. you. People that was not yeah. basketball, basketball fans. Yeah. And basketball yeah. is no, just no, a no, global no, no, sport. Because no, no. yeah, 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 of Mike, was Robin too. Robin and Mike. Yeah. Yeah. Remember, you on the expressway, Robin had his own, uh, remember, what was that on the, uh, what was that, 294? Yeah, his own yeah, billboard with yeah. suit and stuff like shut rock down. Star. Yeah, that's what I said. You said I don't know, Cubs because everybody's not a Cubs fan in Chicago. Yeah, but still, it was, was just like I get what you say. I'm not that, saying it was. It was jumping though. It was. It was, jumping, it was, it was I'm not gonna say it was. The seventh largest gathering in human series. history, nigga. What you say? It was the seventh large largest gathering in human what? history, nigga. What was the, the, the Cubs parade? The, Cubs. the parade for the fucking Cubs, yeah. nigga. Okay, the Bears won Super Bowl. It's beating it. Okay, okay. You're, you're saying that. You you're saying, you're saying that. I just said nah. we didn't witness nah, the Bears in our era. So, so this, this is Chicago. Look, look, this is a football town. Cut, look, niggas came from out of town for the Cubs. I get that. People are nationally. Uh, for Cubs is not. Cubs, I get what you're saying. The first TV. <laughs> I get what you're saying because it comes on Channel Nine. But a lot of the fans go to Arizona. Go to bro. The Bears win. The Bears get sent up. Nah, West, bro. The reason why I think you tweaking on that <laughs> is because exactly. the Bears are trash, right. and them people are there. Every oh, this year. is a football Cubs town. Cubs ain't yeah. been trash for a hundred years. You but feel that's me? everybody's uh, not a Cubs fan. Yeah, it's still you got two divide. teams. Got White Sox. I'm a Sox fan. So, so, no, no, I'm a Sox. I didn't care. The seventh largest gathering in human I history. Get you that. think the Bears gonna beat that yes. when they win? Uh, oh yeah, they beating that. Uh, they they could possibly beat that. They ain't gonna win a lot. Like I'm gonna tell you why. I'm gonna tell you why. You got people who's club fans, but not not necessarily baseball fans. Motherfuckers in Chicago are football fans. Yeah, I understand man. that. Like <laughs> that means like my pops be giving me smoke every time the coach coach lose. I ain't even, I even know a baseball fan like that, but yeah, I think. But, but you're a football think, fan, and, yeah. and plus the drought. Everybody don't like baseball. Everybody like football. I wonder <laughs> if the Bears get there now and they look great. They need. You think they should redo the uh, Super Bowl shuffle song? Or yeah, just I mean, come no, out with their own song. You can't new. do that because that team new. was a whole. Yeah, no, nah. no. Do nah. some new stuff. It's, it's don't even do that. First of all, they made that during the season. That's how cocky they was. Yeah, and it made sense, it made sense <laughs> right. for the times. The goofy stuff they was. Doing. They knew they was they going to do some new goofy stuff. Yeah, nah. new age. Yeah, yeah. yeah. My, I said the last thing I say about Caleb. I don't mind him being an asshole and cocky. That don't bother me. Nah, me neither. 
long as you just come in and play, because you got to be a dick and ass. Like, if he a beast, we going to love that. We yeah. were like, come on, we got a beast here. He I talking shit. I don't like those like Zara shift manager outfits. <laughs> He kind of looked crazy. <laughs> and I will yeah. say, they will get on him. I thought best about Where if he, if he, if he comes to the game with a dress, the fingernails paint, and like then. When he had that long red shirt, oh, that was spooky. Man. Football players be wilding now. <laughs> <was> spooky. <laughs> no, basketball right behind him. Basketball. Yeah, football got the cake, though. What's that, Jerry Grant? When he came? Uh -uh. No, basketball got these dudes basketball beat on the cake. Basketball got these dudes beat because. They play more games, so they went yeah. crazy as shit. Yeah. <laughs> What's that? Cal Kuzma? Cal Kuzma? Kuzma? Yeah. Yeah. He got 82 crazy Cal Kuzma. Yeah, I'm like, exactly. Cal, Cal, Cal Kuzma, after he prepped and get ready to dress, he put on a blindfold and just pick shit. Got 82 crazy fits. They That's can't crazy. say nothing about AI. The stuff that AI was wearing, they can't. Nah. I just seen a video of AI uh, going into a game. He had on the, um, <laughs> I got this wrestling shirt on. What's the name? Mean Street Posse. He had like a Mean Street Posse sweater on, two chains. Decent. These dudes? <laughs> <laughs> They look like what was the boots? They look shit. like what was, um, the, what was the Mario uh, boots? The SGA. Yeah, wearing? they look like Nickelodeon snowboarders or something. <laughs> <laughs> you looking yeah, crazy? Yeah, <laughs> That's how Shay look with them boots and the, he got baggy boots. <laughs> boots got like uh, extra seventy five gigs you, with the but jeans. You use Nickelodeon after the uh, documentary, when you were like a, a, a robot or something. Wait, what? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that was a little he he segue. I didn't watch the Nickelodeon <laughs> documentary. I, ain't I don't want to, man. What's wild. going on? Where you been at with Nickelodeon? The Me Too Nickelodeon stuff? No, all, the, all the little kids was tempered with and shit? Yeah. The feet, the feet Nickelodeon sign? That's they like a, a representation of the foot fetish that people Bro, had. What? It was a character. This last time I'm saying about it. It was a character <clears throat> that had pickles. That's all I'm going to say. Yeah. You talking about Tommy Pickles? No. Yeah, that's what the fuck you talking no. about too. It was a it was a dude who had a platter. He was a superhero. He was dressed up with pickles on him. What? They were shaped like, yeah. They were shaped like the hammers. <laughs> Man, Man look, crazy. ain't no fill in the blank, bro. Like, crazy. They were shaped like, yeah. They were shaped like, yeah. And he had a he had a plate of it. What show was this? Yeah. All that. I don't want to watch that. When we oh, got a little man. bit, a little bit. When we got older, well, yeah, bro. we got older. We so, were watching all so that. You, watch it, you watched it? I saw the stop. Let me see Instagram. You saw I'm saying, TikTok. You, oh, you ain't watched the documentary. Nah, so this just no. this just came out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Sure. Are, the, are the people who produced this show in jail? Huh? Like, what's going on? They getting cooked. They, they getting, yeah. yeah, they getting cooked. Cooked or they? They just. I think they just publicly getting cooked. Kelly type shit. So worse, it's, it's, like, it's it just as worse. Should be. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. Like, what it should it? happen? It should happen. No. One of the mom was even defending him. Yeah, yeah. My son wasn't. He didn't get touched. So then he he represented our family and put us in a situation. Like, wow. come on. Yeah, spook, nasty work. Yeah, nasty sick Nickelodeon work. Sickelodeon. Sickelodeon. <laughs> yeah, that's what I call it. Like Sickelodeon. That's crazy. Man, I want. I don't want to even get him the Cause, Cause you I said, said it. it. Yeah. I said, no, the players just like snowboarders from. <laughs> <laughs> they dress like Rocket Power. The NBA players are just like Rocket Power skaters. And stuff. Like they don't, yeah, they just crazy. And then the Zesty work made you think about the Zesty Nickelodeon I people. I got to talk about Zesty. The way anyway. what he do now? He said the reason he dressed the way his, his uncles, that's what he, his, his uncles and father. That was father. a real quote? Yes, I seen the meme in the caption. I'm like, I don't believe. I don't oh, just he believe said that. his uncles and fathers was dressing like it was grooming him like that. I think that's true. What? How old were they? Who old was grooming him like? How, old, how, how, okay, how old he you said dress like he, he's saying how like in the in the seventies how dudes used to dress with the bell bottoms and all. Yeah, because I was about and, to say how, open shirts like Prince. I was about to say how old that's is different he? with the Wayne Wade wearing, bro. Okay, but look, you can say Prince. Uh, the open I, shirt with your chest out with the Wayne Wade wearing. Well, two different things. That's what he used to dress. The Ozzy's brothers were I'm not spooky. saying nothing right. Come on, mama, they had the, the title Ozzy's shirts. brothers were spooky. Prince was spooky, but he'll take your bitch. Yeah, that, you can take him at all, but the niggas still had some <laughs> that was questionable attire. Not like the rest. Not with these dudes, though. I ain't saying it with yeah, yeah, the butt out. Yeah. Okay, and look, his uncles are listening to that shit. I, I'm just so repeating what the man said. I'm just people with the I'm saying, face. I'm saying, I'm thinking it's true because Earth, Wind, and Fire, them <laughs> niggas used to have zesty tops, adventurous. All of Rick James, all of them. Yeah, them niggas look like 
these are the guys that probably raised it. <laughs> but did you know they was they was they was doing that to get women? As crazy as that, they wouldn't have to get women. It's crazy as that. They was getting yeah. women doing dressing like Prince coming up. All the females love Prince. Thank you. Them All niggas look like they was dressing like <clears throat> girls and getting girls. Them niggas used to dress like <laughs> game blouses. Metrosexual archaeologists. <laughs> but niggas wearing bell bottoms now again though, low key. Dudes wearing blouses <laughs> and pearls. Crazy. Crazy. Piece of stuff, yeah, dudes wearing pearls and, and yeah. blouses now. Bell bottoms not feminine though. For them here. times, bell bottoms my feet. Oh, okay, okay. For yeah. them times, bell bottoms. Where next episode then? You say what? Where next episode? I just said for them times. I don't want to wear. <laughs> he said no times. And no, because you say where sure now, man. Time. Dudes are wearing crazy stuff. History yeah. repeat itself. Shit. Dudes are wearing crazy stuff but, right now. Um, Mars kind of flipped the bell bottoms just to make them tighter. Mars wearing the over the cuff pants now. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. And they exactly. just tighter, so they bell bottoms. They just they just for dudes wearing the real flared out. Dude, the well, stuff, right here. The yeah. suits that I've been looking at for yeah. to cover their shoe. The stuff I've yeah, been to cover the shoe right. up. That's now, Mimi was like, yo, I showed the shoe off. Now it's Mine's like, got fitted bell bottoms. That's decent though. <laughs> yeah, Mine's, I, I mess with it. I mess with, with fitted bell bottoms. I ain't gonna wear it, but it's decent though. Some, some, some fitted bell bottoms is some crazy. Some of <laughs> some, <laughs> some, sometimes with the, the shoe, it look decent with the cut. It do look decent. With the white shoe, the with a white one, it look decent because you know it's a white one. And your white one could probably be cooked and you could get like an extra look. You could get an extra look. I was looking at suits for the wedding. Hey, a light bulb when I was like, wait. Hey. I may be looking at might be cooking. Better I be looking zesty at my wedding with them tight ass suits. Hell no. Nah. You got a big ass 2003 suits? No. Yeah, yeah, 2003 NBA. Like, I ain't saying that. Carmelo was a draft suit. Nah. No, no. Those was wild times, man. Mom was just trying to. Yo, that had to be crazy as a. um. What is that? What A tailor. For Vince Carter and them to be coming in and they like, yo, you get dudes fitted, you know, European Man, they just, cuts. They have to just buy that shit. You had to just go to the Mr. Shop and you just say, like, get You had to get shit. it made. You think you six, eight, where you gonna go to shop? You six, eight. No, nah, you're not getting that made. They, well, was, they, was, they, they was getting, getting that made. Tall, like, let me get that, let me get that. Darius Miles and Kiwi on their pod. They said it was a uh, dude in LA, all the NBA players to go to. It was a he special had to be dude. laughing making that shit. How you laughing? You laughing to the bank? Yeah, laughing to the bank and that's it. Yeah, shit, on bro. That was a style back right then. The <laughs> I remember I saw one dude in an all white seven X tuxedo at that draft. I don't know who was it. LeBron who had that on. Brian had the white joint, right? Yeah, white. Yeah, he Brian was one too, man. He's just white. Nigga, his shoe was big as hell, too. <laughs> he's 6'8". <six laughs> <eight>. What the fuck? <laughs> <is? laughs> no, 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 come on, bro. No, 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 because you said he's 6'8". What do you expect? That. Look at look how they dress this now. I know that. I know, but I'm just saying. They didn't have to wear like that. They didn't have to dress like that. What I'm saying is, compare LeBron suits to like, what was that, Jalen Rose and somebody Walker suits? It was horrible. Man. So Mikey Walker Mars came out. He, he, like a, he like a pimp. We had the pimp <laughs> hat. <laughs> 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 I knew he was going to be trash when he had the magician hat. <laughs> 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 like, like, Mars went out bad. <laughs> All those bro, I'm glad I wasn't grown at that time. That Them outfits era, was crazy. That Beggy era was. Man. Them outfits is. That shit decent. Different. I used to go ask for a 3X. Right. That's crazy. The fuck. Me. Go ask for 3X. <laughs> yeah, 3X. I can't even get it. We got, we got a one for you. It ain't big enough. I don't even want this shit. That's crazy. Swipe like a motherfucker in them fucking 3X t-shirts and shit. I found, I found one of my throwbacks the other day. Bro, I put that on. That was okay to like. Who, uh, which yeah, throwback shit, was it? Uh, George Gervin, All-Star. Yeah, just go get that shit tailored, man. <laughs> what? Get that shit tailored. Get that shit cut down. Get it cut down. Put, put the little champion thing right back. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 For real. They gonna, they gonna cut that bitch. Y'all laughing, but that's together. how they That's a throwback, bro. I said the bitch with that joint. The number yeah. gonna be all <laughs> That's a joint, why? Now, the if the number is a certain way, you might have to leave that shit alone. I gotta redo this shit. Y'all might have to leave that shit alone. Y'all might have to leave that shit alone. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, speaking of that documentaries, shit. y'all seen that damn Freak Nick documentary? I ain't lost. I gotta watch it. I heard it was like woke. I watched it. What you was both. They said it was like, yo, it wasn't what you thought. It was, they were like talking about. They were just talking about the importance of it, of being in Atlanta. If, if that's woke, I don't, I guess. The importance of being in Atlanta. How? Yeah, because yeah, Atlanta. Freak League and then the Freak League and the, um, the Olympics. That's what changed Atlanta. Those are two things that changed Atlanta. Mm. I'm just saying the importance of it. That was the biggest gathering where black people could come yeah. together and. Kid Damn, since Black the Million Man started, March? When was the Million Man this March? The, wait, what? This man all over the place. The Million Man March. Yeah, what? No, you <laughs> said the biggest gathering of black yeah. people. We're, I thought about no, the Million Man March. No, I'm saying a gathering where black people can go. <laughs> million Man March was like 94. Freak Nick was like 
Early, 96, 95. No, Freak Nick was like late 80s, early 90s. It was all the way. Freak Nick ended in 99, be, right? Before, but it was before, before it was the rest in the 80s, of bro. America got on it. It was just something the colleges right. did in Atlanta. Yeah, yeah, true. It was in the 80s. And then it got big. People, That's when people after started while, coming in. Yeah. Like 31st. Somebody's bum is on the 31st. 31st about to be even bigger, ain't it? Pause. <laughs> I don't want. I like it like it is. I though. like it I don't, how it is. But I don't know. Each year, it get too crazy, bro. I ain't coming no more. Okay, each no year, more, yeah. I'm lying, yeah. but I see too many. <laughs> I see too many young people. Yeah, I started seeing the young money, cash monies. I, ain't yeah, going I don't on. think they gonna come. There's too much. Uh, first of all, the music. They don't like that music. And then the police. Just, oh, the, that's one place that you say is regulated. I don't think the young people gonna mess that up. I see them more and more. You see him with them. Like, <laughs> you get bad. You get bad, you get bad as hell. Right. <laughs> Let's see you little I ain't gonna hold you. Yeah. See, if I go my, pocket, my pocket is like 32, 33 and up type stuff. So I don't yeah. wanna kick with no shorties. If man. I see my uh, pocket 35 and up. I don't wanna kick with no shorties. Shorty man. with the shiesty mask on on 31st, man. it's over with. I just gotta cut my losses. Like, why man. are we in the same place, man? man You're a shorty. You don't think you want something totally different. Yeah. He said the shiesty man <laughs> the shoot out with the cop. Yeah, I seen that. Yeah, them. Yeah, that's what he had on. He had on the shiesty mask. Wait, what? What happened? What the hell you be at, nigga? Chicago. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck y'all talking about either. Uh, it was a guy shooting at the cop. It was a kid. Kid shooting at the in cop. In Chicago. In yeah. Chicago with the shiesty mask on. What else yeah. happened? Southside. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Out west. I don't want to put it out on the south side. I'll put it out on the south side. I ain't got to put it on our west. It happened out south. Over the east. Yeah, it was past 35th. Yeah. It was past 35th. You feel me? So that yeah, happened yeah. out south. Yeah, you feel me? You said the hip got on. Um, speaking of speaking Smash and grab. Um, bro, I seen that shit. How yeah. the fuck you got out the hip with that shit, though? Speaking out of, of mom, criminal, criminal Man, because ain't nobody trying to have them problems. Everybody got sense now. I was just there two days ago, bro. Bro, they everybody, he said picking grass? up the jacket, but everybody got sense now. If I see somebody. That's wild. Jacking, distilling stuff. So what did they get? I mean, uh, the help, jury. Fuck. fuck. Oh. oh. It's yeah, in, they, that stuff insured. Wait, the one when you come in through the back, through like this. I haven't been there in some yeah. time. So across so from know. one of the jewelry places is Stitch and Print. South of Stitch and Print. That's where I get a lot of my cool people stuff stitched up at. Mm -hmm. And right across is a jewelry joint. I wonder if it was them. I was just talking to that lady. Dang. Oh. That's crazy. Yeah, but um what kind of car they just use a regular they rented a car or I don't know. I don't know that part. I, I, all that show them going there busting shit. Snatch. Oh, they went in and was just hitting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, they, I thought they did the, the, the car in there. Because the jury's going to talk about there's there's shit. There's there's shit. Daytime. It's right by the back door. This motherfucker's in the mall. But my thing is this. If y'all want to put a stop to it, you seriously probably don't want to because you're not who y'all got in there securing it? Uh, somebody making, and this ain't me wage shaming, but like 15 an hour, not armed. Why you think the kids? Even if they do got a gun, I'm about to be going at it with these guys. But then, well, it's like a law. Like That's why the kids be going in the mall. Yeah, that you can't really you even can't chase stop them. them. You yeah, can't, you can't even chase, chase them no more. That's why they be going so, to Nike outlets. Yeah, for real? Still. Yeah. I wouldn't anyway. I get it. I get it, though, <laughs> because if something happened. Right. To your family member over some insured insure product. What is that? I remember mm -hmm. I was uh, working um, Nordstrom Rack doing loss prevention. And Lil Reese and his guys came up there. I got on the mic and said, yo, if they steal something, I'm not I'm not stopping them. <laughs> <laughs> I told my manager that right when they were on the elevator. They steal something, I'm not stopping them. Now, I mean, they, they shoot a day, I'm not stopping them. Why you get on the mic and <laughs> Because I'm not, I'm not doing that. Man, what? That's Look some racist that. shit, bro. <laughs> racist? You prejudice. Racist? I'm hey, a profile like a wall. You prejudice, You prejudice, though. You pre bro. Bro. That's some prejudice shit, bro. How many niggas do they bro. say they shoot in their songs? Bro. Okay. Okay. But here for the you got on the mic and told the whole I know that. The only thing you, I think, the, you think oh, everybody man. went and got money. Hey, you bugging, bro. Yo, yeah, that, yeah. Was <laughs> that was funny. That was funny. Hey, little Reese yeah. dude was like, oh, that's who told on us? <laughs> you prejudiced the same. Right. I'm a realist. <laughs> I have to be a realist. <laughs> I'm the only one oh, that was man. technically, you could argue, in shape in my, in my uh, oh, apartment. Jesus. Everybody else is kind of like older, respectfully. <sighs> Little Reese and these young ass dudes up in here, they go, I, and I knew it. You know what you could have did? Hey, I'm finna go on break for a minute. Why you say do nah, that? No, 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 no. Did they nah. steal? No, nah, but they ain't bad uh, now. Cause they ain't see shit. So you know, they window shopping. Cause I knew, shopping. you know what was hot around that yeah, time when Little Reese was hot? They go straight no to the true religion rap. Oh, I thought you was gonna say love, yeah. 
It went, I was like, yeah. He was about that whole motherfucking rap. But he heard, he heard me on the yeah, mic, right? My mama, exactly. There you go. Man, I, well, you think I said that shit when he was right there? <laughs> <Sweet. Yeah. laughs> my ass, boy. I was <laughs> down that long ass escalator and was like, yo, wow. you see them? They didn't even know who they was. I said, that's Lil Reese right I there. I heard it all. Drill rapper. <laughs> talking about smoking 55 niggas every song. If they steal something, it is what it is. This man plug it. Letting y'all know right that's now. That's funny, bro. Hey, man. <laughs> like, that's the nigga that told him. Look. <laughs> Hey, man. That's hilarious, man. Hey, man. I, I, Racial profiling, man. Shit. Oh, I, I live to tell it. <laughs> man, it's still shit. So? <laughs> oh, man. So that shit. See, yeah, y'all sound hot. That shit y'all talking about sound hot. Oh, man, you did that. Yeah, you let the little niggas walk in on you. That's crazy. Yeah, I ain't saying nothing. I'm just buying my damn business. business. I'm for the key work and shit. Right, right. They ain't bothering me. I ain't bothering them. Nothing, nothing to do with me. All right, because y'all ain't lost prevention. Y'all ain't got to stop them. I ain't gonna stop I'm them. not like stopping them. They could have stole anything. I'm not they, stopping them. They gonna find out. I ain't gonna stop so them. So y'all gave me flag, but y'all no. Ain't you said no. you got on the I'm mic. On the mic, man. Come on, bro. <laughs> because my team was gonna ask, like, yo, why you ain't stopping them? Be like, y'all stop them, shit. To pre, pre, to pre get on the mic is wild. <laughs> yeah. No, it's yeah, not. It's yeah. wild, bro. How's that wild? It's prejudice, bro. You prejudice against your own kind. So if King Von walk in there, he finna buy some shit. What the? I know he finna. King Von, these is millionaires. I would take a picture with him, then I'm bounce. Hey, I finna go on my lunch break. Bounce. If King Von and his guys walk in there and they say, "Yeah, we finna take this," shit. You that's know, like me when I work at the airport. A rapper oh and you walk in somewhere without a without a poo shiesty and steal something. <laughs> right. That's on you. I'm at the airport. I saw Chief <laughs> Keith. I saw Chief Keith and his whole is. crew. That's like me getting on the airport. I'm like, hey, Chief Keith in here. No, Watch it's not. Flight no, it's not. Right, it's a flight risk. risk. No, it's not. <laughs> it's the same shit. No, it's not. That's, That's worse. The same shit. No, it's not. It's worse. Okay. We got a diehard yeah. situation. <laughs> and they smell. And they was lit. They was smell. They was lit. See, look, you in that whole to big ass airport. Right. You got a bar, so you go shoot the whole big ass airport. You can just get out the way. I'm in a store. <laughs> but that's a federal no, offense if I do that. That's federal when you're at the airport. I'm okay. not for, you, you can got, get out the way, though. <laughs> you can get out crazy. the way. Look, if I saw them in the airport, I wouldn't care. I wouldn't even say Ooh. shit because I'm in an airport. Them niggas go that way, I go that way. I see I'm a, in a whole I see store. I'm rappers in a I saw, that's like me getting on the mic. Hey, Cameron Family's in here. They have flight risk. Hey, you got on the mic, bro. <laughs> now, these niggas being watched because of you. All right. I, I guess y'all trying to shave me, but it ain't going to work on me. Who phone going off Somebody like that? Somebody get the phone. <laughs> Gina. Gina. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> That's your phone, boo. Come on, boo. Get your like, shit together, boo. Stop yeah, the like mookery. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. You got the gym. Well, um, what Every else? Time. What else? Well, we, we on, we, I know we going back and forth, but we on sports still, right? Yeah, we was on sports. What else going on the with state sports? Of the basketball, man. Go Kitch. Can't argue with that. Go kitch. I won't act to somehow. I won't it's act to steal happening. it. It's not happening. It's go is the MVP. Go kitch. Well, I, I won't go. I want them to be like fuck. Nah. You. I mean, go kitch. Well, we passed thirty but minutes. Yeah, James Harden. Give it to uh, James Harden MVP. I'm gonna ask Val this because he be shitting on Westbrook. <laughs> What's the difference between Yogi's triple doubles and Westbrook triple doubles? He's uh, about to win big. I got an answer for that. And, I know he's not, and, and he's not, and he's not doing it in a my player mode. There we go. There <laughs> we go. It's, uh, everything is purposeful. Yeah. <laughs> Every that was point, the, no, rebound. It didn't stop like that. I not disagree. It didn't stop like that. When you said my player, everybody get it. Look, like, I'll just, never forget I this game. I disagree with you. When it, Westbrook first started triple doubles, it didn't start like that. Cool. When he realized he can get them, he went. Yeah, he went to yeah, my. But player I'll never mode. forget this game. They was in Mexico City. I think Joker doing the same thing. I think it's coming naturally. It do. He got better players. Same thing. Uh, you can't say he's doing more naturally and it's the same thing. If, he's, say, if, he's, doing if he's trying to get a triple double, that's doing the same thing. But if it's natural. I, I cut the natural shit out. Thank you. He's trying to get a triple double. Who, Jokic? Yeah. And win in fashion. It, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. He got better players so, around. Look, I'll say, I'll say this. Thank I, you. I, I remember oh, Westbrook. Yeah, he's not going to jump over his teammate back to get the rebound, to get the like three rebound. Seven Adams. foot, though. He ain't got two. <laughs> but you get my point. I get that. What I'm saying, Steven Adams, he's seven him. foot, right. so he no should be rebounds. getting the rebound. You get what? It, that's what we saying. Yeah, Steven Adams is how, on how on how tall he is. He should be getting the ball. No, he cleared, he cleared the way. He cleared the way. Who brings that flying out the way like Peter Parker, <laughs> Westbrook? But look, it's an old fact. 
Steve Adams used to clear the way for work with the, the rebound. Okay, nigga. I hear that. That's okay, even that. You feel me? Y'all doing too much. You doing no. too much. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Boxing out for your teammates. Right, doing look, too wait, much? wait, wait. When the when you can grab so the rebound. So if I set a pick, don't look at me like that. When if I set a pick, that's doing too much. When you can just get the rebound. That's what rebounding is about. I'm boxing out so my teammate get the ball if I can't get it. Joking past the ball, niggas hurry up and shoot so he can get assists. Literally. Literally, that's what the fuck be going on. Just get the rebound himself. Let's be real. How many center footers right now are averaging 10 rebounds? Honestly. These niggas Bro. trash. You <laughs> boxing out. How many seven footers are averaging 10 rebounds, Drew? I don't know, but I don't want my center boxing out and then looking. Is my point guard finna get it? When he supposed to be getting the rebound and catching it in stride. I'm, I'm just you saying. You a bitch, your center. Like, go get the damn rebound. Right, you know what the fuck is you doing? What's two? Because I'm different. I'm with the outlet. I'm trying to run. I'm trying to run. If I'm trying to get the assist, I'm trying to get the assist, though. That's a my player. I'm trying to get the assist. That's a my player shit. Bro, I used to do it. If I had nine assists, I'm like, yo, I'm trying to get 10. I will be on some my player shit. Because I like getting 10 assists. I'm trying to get the. Okay, so that that's what we saying Westbrook on. Like I said. What's wrong with that? He was overdoing it. It's in losing fashion. He was overdoing it. Joker got more help again. Look, I hear you. I hear you. It was his game in Mexico City. That nigga was playing against the Mavericks. He knew it was it. I remember that shit. In the West. Hey, come on, bro. Right. Look, it's game in Mexico City. On Tuesday, thank It was a close game. <laughs> Westbrook could have shot this three to like ice it. He had nine assists. He was wide open. He sat there. He just sat there. Yeah, I remember and dribbled and dribbled, and then his homie. Then he finally kicked out, and homie missed a three. I'm like, bro, I remember that. Y'all not even the number one seed, and you playing around like this? Maybe, like, maybe, maybe, bro, maybe, like, like, bro, maybe, bro. maybe it's a, uh, uh, instead of in his contract. He averaged a triple double for the season to get extra five mil West, or some shit. West, it's, it's, the end, shit. it's the end of the game, though, right? Win the game, and then the next game you just get eleven assists. So what you want him to shoot a three? No, no, no. I'm just saying. You're not good on the three. West. No, no, no. You want Westbrook to shoot a three or you want it from the pass? There you go. That's my point. West. That's my Answer point. Answer the question. That's my point. Do you want Westbrook to shoot a three or you want him to pass? pass I want him to pass, but what y'all my, not My man's been shooting like 30% from the arc for like the last five, six years. That's why I'm six six years. laughing. What y'all not going to do is act like Westbrook just don't be jacking that bitch, period. <laughs> 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 he just be Look, jacking man. that bitch. When it's the end of the game, nobody's ever going to put him on six. I'm just saying. He got criticized. He was one of away from the triple though. What was his is, field goal percentage? That's what I want to know. I need to know. If it's the end of the game, don't, don't risk the end of the game losing to try to get a stat. If, the if next I'm game, off, but if I'm off, game, I'm not trying to shoot. Assist, now you off but that's what I'm saying. How's the rest of that game go? If I'm off that game, I ain't looking to shoot. My whole point is, though, you get one play. Westbrook was getting criticized for his triple doubles, and I'm saying other dudes get triple doubles. I seen them shoot for the game. But he said, hold on, I don't want to diminish triple doubles. Yeah, I really don't. I really don't. Like Luke, that's exactly what y'all doing. No. Lucas, it's trying to have that conversation. Luka. It's trying Luka. to have that conversation. Luka doing too much too. What? What I, thought Jay, I thought your boy James Harden had what the ball. What conversation? Woo. He James Harden without a tan. That's all he is. <laughs> Kyrie had a time in his life when Luca was gone. Yeah. <laughs> I don't understand why he don't play better for them two. Well, I don't understand. Because Luca and Jason Kidd, the coach. That's the crazy part he about it. He's not a good coach to me. I think he's a good coach to get your team to like the next level. But after he's that next Maintain, level, it's time yeah. to. Well, it's the NBA. The star is the like, star of the team. Like Luca should be playing point guard to me. No, he shouldn't. Real. He shouldn't. But, but he's the star but, of the team. But, but so. listen, now at one point, Jason Kidd had motherfucking Giannis playing point guard. Who's the star of the team? Giannis. The star gonna do what they want to do. Look, I, the look, coach, I get point four. Look, I but get point four. No, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. You think Kidd you, making you got a ball point dominant, forward? The best and you got a point mm -hmm. guard. Yeah. These niggas just start at the point guard. Yeah. Nah, bro. No, but let's talk about how they say the era we grew up on, 2000s is garbage and unathletic. And the two coldest dudes are European slow dudes. They can't jump. What happened? You say what? Well, I don't think people say the 2000s is terrible. I think they say they say 80s and 90s. They say the 80s and 90s is trash. But Jokic and Luka, slow and just with skill, killing all of these dudes. No, they not. They they downside. I think is defense. Mm -hmm. Like people forget they these niggas gonna play defense. That's why when they At say um, Jokic, mean, Jokic top five, I'm like he can end yeah. up in the top five. But Hakeem, I ain't gonna say he don't play. He, 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 he had Tim. He had Tim to play, play defense. Luka ain't playing no defense. I, yeah, I take I take a healthy At least Jokic actually Jokic blocked a shot. You say who? I take a healthy and beat over Jokic any day. Healthy and beat is crazy. I can't be mad at that. I can't be mad at that neither. I'll take a healthy when he got his head straight. 
AD. I, I was gonna say AD. AD, hell no. You should see he what too, I had to say. He if he consistent. healthy, he got his hands. <laughs> hey, he he is he healthy? Bro. Hey, hey. he's consistent. Hey. <laughs> That New Orleans give me, AD? Give me, give me bubble AD over all these big guys. That New Orleans AD? New Orleans and New bubble AD. New Orleans AD only made the playoffs fuck, once, me, bro. Fuck that. Give me a... The bubble Sac- AD was crazy. Give me a Sacramento DeMarcus like Cousins. He could have got MVP. But he was, he was playing power forward because he's soft. He was, that's what he need to go. He need to go back to the Give me a foe. Sacramento DeMarcus. DeMarcus. And he guarded, Jim, he yeah, guarded yeah, Jimmy... Yeah, Butler he guarded Jimmy Butler after that first game. Come on, man. He was guarding Jimmy Butler, Hey, yo, Wes, when the last time you put AD on your old fan duel ticket? I don't. I don't either. That man is banned, bro. Yeah, he got here on my band list. Yeah, he banned, man. Man, he's that, that bad. You can't even yeah, bet money on him. I don't trust that. I don't trust him. him. I, I got a lot of niggas on the band list. I do, too. I ain't play. That's I ain't why I do. I can't do it. Do it. Man, Everybody, I don't even do points. No more. I do more so rebounds and assists. You know what I do? I play threes. That's two. Threes, rebounds, I do, assists. I do mainly threes. I do everything but points. Because I just looked at it and I said, yo, you know what these dudes going to do a lot? Shoot threes. So one and a half, two and a half. That's the only thing I'm playing. I gotta get on the fan do a look. Yeah, I got. I, got I only play threes. These I'm, these niggas trust them for twenty points. Yeah, hell, I'm too, I'm too competitive. Parlay, parlay, you straight. I'm yeah, too, three I'm, three to four. I'm too Don't go past that. I I, uh, I go crazy. You'll go crazy. That's probably why I'm you, too competitive. I will if I was see Eddie say. Davis, I will smack the hell out of him for not getting the twenty points I need. You, people go crazy off fantasy. Mom's be talking. If reckless. I see him, I'm telling you, you gonna gonna beat, beat your, your ass. ass don't point him. Like I agree with West. <laughs> yeah, beat your ass. I agree with West. <laughs> don't fuck them points on betting because you're betting on. I you're thought not, you was agree you're with me not saying. Beat his ass. You're not saying he will beat his ass. But I'm saying like with twenty points. No, you can't even reach up there. You ain't going crazy. I'm gonna hit him in his face. <laughs> With 20 points, how many baskets you got to make? Like that. That nigga can really All I had to do was hit him in his seven, knees. Seven, seven to ten. You free bet throws. on the nigga to make a seven to ten basket. <laughs> I'd rather bet on the dude to make two threes. Now, look. Only only two niggas I do bet on points is uh, Shea now, and Luca. I knew he was about to say Shea. And Luca. But, but they lines be crazy. But look, I only do 25. I, I, I do it to Adam yeah, and, and shit. Yeah, yeah, you, you parlay I, it. See, that bring me to like, because you know they getting 25. And that bring me to the point like the state of basketball, like how easy it is to get 25. Remember Whoa. dudes was getting 20, we thought they was cold? Yeah, the game faster too. Yeah, yeah. a lot yeah. faster. I get it fast, but you know ain't nobody playing no defense. It be, like yeah, I said, it's, it's a mixture of all that. It's, it's a, a mixture of no defense and fast. It's a struggle to watch sometimes. It's, like it was a struggle to watch the NCAA game. You love the new one? Hell yeah. I'm not, I'm not. I love how to move. I'm not is. against it. Only, they are. I ain't against it. I'm just saying. The only thing they should bring back is hand checking, bro. Yeah, just bring not, that and back. And not, not necessarily how they used to do it like this. Right. Yeah, 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 nigga. You, you can touch. Yeah, bro, you can yeah. touch somebody. Well, I'm just saying the group yeah. chat. Now, you can't push like, it, but yeah. if your hand like this already, cool. Yeah. Cool, yeah, yeah. And off the ball. And off the ball. You said who? And off the ball. Yeah. If Steph Curry is running on the curl or running around, I should be able to touch him. Yeah, I see. As a big man, baby, to stick my elbow. What series was that? The elbow, the elbow is crazy. What series was that? Like when the first game, like the first two minutes, Pat Beverly was like on Steph Curry, and they called three fouls quick on him. He wouldn't really touch him. I can't even remember that. Watching high school in college is blocking, blocking foul heaven. That's all you remember. Blocking foul, blocking foul, blocking foul. I'm getting tired of it. Yeah. Oh, speaking of like bogus calling, football just changed the tackle. The hip drop. She's about to repeat. She's about to repeat. Wow. You Wait, can't, about to tackle, you you can't tackle nobody on their hip no more. How you about to trap? Wait, tackle? what? Thank you. That's How? crazy. How you about to get Travis Kelsey? So you got a leg and more body? They about to repeat. You either do now. So, so you got a why, leg or body. That's why I don't get mad. Hit Wait, stick what? or nothing. That's why I don't get mad. Nobody <laughs> can't tackle. You either going to have to lower your shoulder and knock somebody down, which that's wow, hard. For real. Or you going to have to wrap their leg or go up top. It's, yeah. So I don't know how you're supposed to tackle you him. Wait, wait, you can't, you can't hit him. He's about to go out this you, year. If you're run, think, about, think about it. You're Derrick Henry. Right. And I'm on the angle. I'm, and I got to try to get you by your hip. Now it's a penalty. But but look, on some real shit, you don't go for Derrick Henry. He's a bad example. You don't go for his head. No, but you I'm saying that's it's certain dudes. I get, I get what you're right. saying. Right. You, you, you got to get him down, though. Right. Right. Just to slow him down. I mean, you got to slow him down from the hip, bro. Derrick Henry, you got to get it. He did not. Pause. You got to get it. You got to go all legs, my nigga. Diddy, no Diddy. That's what I said. Pause. You got to get it. No Diddy. No Diddy. No Diddy is crazy. I ain't doing that. No Diddy. That is crazy. Speaking on, <laughs> speaking on Diddy, oh, this is man. a terrible segue, but he's a rapper. Oh, wow. We can go to the rap talk. Big three. Yeah, big three. Fuck the big, big three. Me. It's just big me. Big future. Yeah. It's big future. Mm. Um, I'll start the convo with this. Big future. We talk about this big three of Kendrick, Drake, and Cole. When future album-wise has been the most consistent. That's what I be saying. 
You know, on the way here, Future has been the most consistent. On the way here, I swear, I was like, I'm like, last shit, the only time he didn't drop an album since he been out, which is wild. I feel like, he just set the bar for album of the year. For rap album, sound year. like Snoop. That nigga don't miss. <laughs> he don't, especially ever. after DS two. Since, since 2008, I thought DS two. I was like, okay, that this might be it. Right. Then he came with Evil. I was how long like, Future? How oh. Future been out? 2007, 2008. Since damn near the same year. Drink, right? yeah, yeah. 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 came about yeah. the same time. Killing, killing. They, everybody say his work acting crazy though in the studio. I could imagine. They's like, like he, you know, how some artists go through a bunch of beats. They say he just tell his nah, producers he just put go. on whatever. And yeah, I'm put just, on. He just I'm go. I'm just freestyling. And just what's go through left on about future? His right, his pen game. The songs that you don't expect drunk, him to write. Drunk in love and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I don't think I don't think He's that should be slept on though because. But they, I'm just saying, you, know, you, you think of future, you don't think oh pen right, you don't think. You don't bullshit. think that I don't, I, I don't I'm not gonna say that like not you just you a rapper you right yeah, yeah, you yeah, but I'm yeah, saying like the yeah, average I yeah, I get fan you. I get you they think yeah. about future they're not thinking like oh he right right he right yeah just writing bars that's cool but to put you together songs. a song you gotta make hits you gotta yeah man to put together a song that's tough yeah but uh we here now we it's long away they've been like ten years of subliminals <laughs> and you got Kendrick to say yo fuck y'all <clears throat> fuck. J. Cole, I mean, yeah, J. Cole, fuck Drake, what's up? Well, I will say this about Kendrick. He don't strike a lot, but when he strike, it's really not subliminal. It's Yeah, he always come direct. Yeah. And yeah. people know who you're talking about. Because he did the, what, the control? Yeah. It's been about four years since that. Not hell not them four years. That's been longer than, longer than that. Hell yeah. He first came, because that? that was when Kanye, Man, damn when Kanye came years out with Yeezy. After that. Damn, that was that long. Because okay, right. he was an opening act for Kanye when, okay. I, when that came out. But that was blatant. <laughs> Big Sean, them everybody knew who he was talking about. They got Big Sean them out of there. Big Sean was in their camp. Big Sean the and Wale. Funny because he trying to get back in. And me, and Drake and Kendrick got them niggas out of there. there. Meek was right there. I think Meek, Meek was, was. I think Meek was. I think was, was Wiz, Meek was, was right Wiz there. In that a little bit. Nah, nah. Meek was. Meek was right I there. Think, Drake I, got him out of there. I think Meek was on his way to. Uh, yeah, he was on his way to be there. They stopped fucking, fucking with Drake. But I'm saying he was there before they even got to the like. They was like, who gonna be the over the hump? Hmm. That's five straight rapping. Yeah. Big Sean too. But I think yeah. Wiz kind of was in that now. You say you think who? Wiz. I don't think Wiz was in it. Wiz was in his own lane. I think so, yeah. Wiz in it. He in a Snoop lane. He was in like a two yeah, chill I, lane. He was in the currency I, lane of just I, chilling, man. Just making being like, high. Yeah, not nothing hits, that can nothing hits. that's competitive. He wasn't. Not as in competitive, that but I'm just saying he was making he was making hits at that point. I ain't saying he was gonna be where Drake and them at now. But it's funny because Big Sean just made a song talking about yeah, your so-called big three. Yeah. It was cool, but Kendrick said, fuck all that talk. You ain't even <laughs> fuck ain't these. Oh, they yeah, been you ain't even relevant. They been yeah, packed, big shot trying to get yeah, in the three. What up. about me? Shit, he went crazy or something. <laughs> but, <laughs> but that's the thing. He When he came, he His song. girlfriend kept him relevant. Uh, Janae Akiko. Oh, uh, Akiko. Akiko. Freak <laughs> body. And yeah. I ain't saying he trash. No, I ain't saying that. Because he got his fan base. Who? But it's levels. Who ain't trash? Yeah. Yeah, all right. yeah, I'm good on that. I used shit. to think he was cold. Then I listened to that. They're like, why the fuck I thought this nigga was cold? I just said he ain't trash. He got a couple good verses. Cold. Yeah, he got yeah. good verses here and there. He got good punchlines. I heard trash. Too. He ain't trash. That's I never like Wale. I know this is gonna sound crazy. Wale rap too fast for me. I like I like Wale. Uh, I like a I couple like of it. Song. Yeah, I'm about to say that his girl tracks song. though. That boy, yeah, he just knocked him out of the park. That I, yeah, that why I say that. I like that while yeah. the other stuff no, is okay. yeah. and because he like any wear shoes. Yeah. I wish he dropped like an He's EP of all chick songs. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it'd be dope. But um, what do you think is gonna happen out here with the updates further? I think I've been keeping my ear to it and eyes to it and seeing what was going on. Um, recently, Drake he liked the comment saying he's not even taking it serious, and then he hopped on stage recently and said. Yeah, everybody want to know how I'm feeling. Ain't nobody fucking with me. Yeah, I see. He's plotting. He plotting. He gonna go take a picture with Sierra. He's the throw the football Demis, with Future I mean, with Russell Wilson in the background. Ball glazing on Drake. You say what happened? Academics ball glazing on Drake. How you gonna I, make yeah, this? Yeah, I love that. I love that. That was funny. Well, he not in album mode. Wait, what? Wait, yeah, he said, said he should take three months to write. Man, yeah, like, like, why are you gonna do this when his when he's sick? What is he talking about? Bro? I wonder what J. Cole is going to do. I think J. Cole he should cook both of them. J. Cole, J. Cole should cook both of them. He got to respond. You think J. Cole shouldn't diss Drake and his? Hey man, Drake, they on tour. They cool. No, they're not on tour anymore. I just uh, found out they're not on uh, tour anymore. But they, they cool by y'all right <laughs> yeah, now. I, I think, if you ask me, I think that was a power play by Drake for a long time. To be cool with J. Cole? Uh-huh. 
I think this is Dancy Drake. He likes everybody. Nah. Cole, Cole nah. got to respond. Uh, Drake is calculated. Yeah, yeah he's calculated, but he, I think he really fuck with J. Cole. I don't think he do. I don't think so. Really? I don't think J. Cole fuck with him. I but J. Cole, no, I like, said Drake, J. Cole ain't going to turn I down the bag, I said Drake fuck with J. Cole. I ain't say yeah, J. Cole. Yeah, because this is why I think that. Because Drake will get on the, on the stage when J. Cole is there. Yo, J. Cole, you're one of the illest. You're one of the best. <laughs> we appreciate you. You're it a did legend. Happen. It did. This shit happened. I'm the best. Ain't nobody fucking with me. It's the sport, What are you supposed to say, though? That's it's cool, but quit sitting side by side with these niggas playing. Nah, buddy, you, buddy. Nah, nah. You, you can you can be homies and both of y'all can think y'all the best. Okay, but look, if y'all think y'all the best, then cut all this. When we gonna get this talk of like when, who's gonna separate themselves? Who's gonna draw the line? This line I think the they same? already separated, honestly. With Drake and J. Cole? Yes. I think they I think they both feel like they're the best at what they do. No, nah, oh, you that, said separate. They, nah, fuck. They, look, did look, they separate look, themselves? We I got, think Drake is on a different plateau than, than J. Cole. Okay, what if J. Cole don't think that? That's cool. Drake, like, you ain't making these records. I'm making oh, Okay, we talking music or we just talking <laughs> like on some pop yeah, style like, shit? See, that's that's a music talk. But with this you number one like thing. As a, as a number one? Yeah, the number one thing, they're going to they're gonna uh, inquire skill on it, too. They're going to talk about yeah. the skill. And I think J. Cole is making a, he's trying to make a case for that. And no, J. Cole has been making, he's been talking the most greasy. He's been talking song, the most greasy. He, he, he making songs saying, y'all don't even want to feature me. The song with, with Yachty. He said, y'all don't want to feature me something, something. Look, this song he got he's, with, he's talking greasy. He, he got, got this song greasy. called, uh, he born, this new little sample shit. we put out. He, before the song, it, it started, nobody fuck with me. I'm the best. I'm, I don't know about y'all. I'm sick of dudes saying I'm the best. And when it's here, it's like quiet. Yo, yeah. we home. That's what I'm saying. We J cool. But J no, Cole, cut the nigga head off. But J Cole been talking. Um, <laughs> cut his fucking head off. What bro. the wild card? What about J Cole? Been talking to put his, his head in the, in the ring. Who? Who? Push a T. Hell no. He ain't got shit to do with that. What the fuck you got to do? I just said, is he gonna throw his head? That's, so we what? talking about who the best? That's hey, what I'm saying. Oh, we, gotta talk, we gotta talk he about that. He's not in that conversation. Gotta, I'm not, no, listen real to what quick I'm saying. Before we keep going, I love Pusher. He's a better MC than Jim that, Jones. I'm, I'm talking Jim music. Jim Jones got him the fuck out of here. No, he didn't. <laughs> Where has he been? Damn. Jim Jones got him the fuck out of here. Damn. Nah, he Jim not, Jones got pushed the fuck man. out of here. This is the reason Damn. why I feel like <laughs> Jones. Did he say anything after the Everybody want to be a rich he boy. Didn't. He didn't, right? <laughs> but let me ask you this. Do you think Drake, how how much press you think Drake got? How much time you think Drake got to respond? Forever. All right. It took Nas, what? Uh, no, I'm asking different, different standards. Different I'm asking Drew. Yeah, I get it. it. Times is different now. <laughs> how, how much you think he? How much time okay. you think he got to respond? If I could put a time on it, Drake Drake got to come with a record in like the next month. J. And Cole got to respond this week. In the next he month, been talking two weeks. We be talking two weeks. <laughs> so in the next month, but why do you feel that way? I just feel like before it died down, like come come before, come with a hit. It's not before because too, too he kind of show niggas I handle business. No, you you feel like you trying to shoot Pusha T the bell. It's not that I'm trying to shoot. I'm, what I'm explaining yeah. is, Pusha T will cook that nigga, bro. We know that's what I'm talking. Forget I'm not what you can do. You. Will you do it? I'm talking strictly bars. I ain't talking about all this the, popularity. But, but if I'm not trying to shoot Push Bell, he do got records cooking. We got to hold these standards to everybody, bro. But you said he got him the fuck out of here. If I want, yet? I like Jim Jones this. I like Jim Jim Jones this against Pusha T. You know that's my favorite guy. Yeah. I like it. But to sit here and be like, "Yo, yes, he got him." I can't say that, man. Man, we, I can't say that. Look, look, look. We know Mike Tyson would beat Buster Douglas, but Douglas got him the fuck out of here that day. <laughs> <laughs> and the reason why I was asking you that that Jim Jones the uh, Drake question is because. When push this, niggas make the news. Niggas like make Instagram comments and like yeah. soliloquies and podcasts with LeBron James. No, no, no. Push is a better MC, but, but, down. but some, you can fuck lose the better it. MC. You can have a you can have fuck, a bad fuck, battle. Look, yeah, because I said fuck the better MC because push wasn't showcasing like lyrical talent on right. Story Adonai. He was just getting at him. Yeah. So I don't think he's at a point where he has to. Like the pressure is on because that shit came and went, G. We just like how long have we we been talking battling and shit like that. It took this for you to bring up Jim Jones and Pusha T. 
We ain't that shit. What do you really think, J Cole? Because he got him out of him. Go on that timeline that you think about, like these dudes. J Cole almost have to, bro, because he been talking. J Cole been talking spicy. Hey, he, he been Khalil I'm not Williams. Saying it. Like Khalil, you got one game to prove yourself. <laughs> like, like uh, the way you like, been talking. Uh, when they interview, <laughs> when they interview, he been talking spicy since he did I don't even Johnny T's caddy. J Cole, so I don't yeah. know what the fuck's going on. When he all them, all these features. <laughs> yeah. yeah, when he, he did Johnny T's caddy. They asked Benny, like, was he dissing you? He was like, nigga, I don't think he was talking about me, but you know them niggas that compare him to? I think he was talking about them niggas. <laughs> so he <laughs> alluded. I think he was talking about Drake. I think he was talking about uh, yeah. Kendrick. And he, no, Kendrick, he said, he mentioned this on Big Three, and then he said, not Big Three, J. Cole said something. He said the Spider-Man joint. Yeah, it's and, me. And and even, you could say Kendrick, arguably. Like Drake looking back. Yeah, and so he excluded, he mentioned yeah. Big Kendrick Three. Be, but Kendrick be on his MJ Kendrick. shit. They but be look, like, I'm tired of y'all comparing me. I'm finna separate myself from y'all. On, on top of that. But look, even on that one, uh, first person shooter, he says something about the steppers. Yeah. He got a line about the steppers. Yeah. Uh, Mr. Morale and the big steppers. He got a line about that. And I just peeped on, on uh, Like That with Kendrick dissing him. He says, I mean, aw, Aubrey Graham. So he's like, this some crazy subliminals, direct subliminals, if that's yeah, a word, uh, so if that's a phrase. But um, I'm, I'm hyped to see what happens. I think Drake... Is gonna cook him though, cause he. I think he's hated that guy for a long time. Okay. But it's a beef with Metro and Drake too, though. That's a great. I was about to tell you the real battle. It's a, it's a real it's a battle we want to see is future and Drake. That's the that's, that's really, is that really a real thing. Thing. So that's the really real thing. Thing. The real so, uh, <laughs> Metro really and Drake had words over Twitter. They had words over Twitter. And about, future, about uh, uh, Metro says something about niggas winning Grammys. Uh, you yeah, yeah, he was tight because he lost the Grammy to Drake. And then Drake was like, uh, all the tweeters, the leaders, and some shit like that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Put it like, let's say, look like, into my you, eye. you got that. Yeah. And then yeah. you have, you have. And you know Future go ride with Drake. I mean, uh, Metro. Metro, because you, you, you got oh, Future yeah. who heard the track, heard what Kendrick said, and said, all right, come on. Put it on his album. But then he put Ross on there. Ross supposedly unfollowed yeah. Drake. Yeah, he got problems they with got, him. They, look, they got Weekend. Weekend and Drake don't fuck with each they other. They don't fuck with each other And no then more. They, they drop another album April 12th. So you know they're going to have some more niggas that hate Drake on that motherfucker too. Damn, I was doing and too it's much. called We Don't Trust You. <laughs> yeah, We Don't Trust You. <laughs> and on the intro, is rumored that Future taking shots at Drake. It sound like it, but. Yeah, like and everything fake chick. about That's you. Supposedly, all of this, what whatever. It is. Supp it's supposedly chick. it's a. He don't like him because over a bitch now too. Yeah. But I don't know. I feel like yo fighting over like beefing but over Drake shakes. Amazing, but he said he said he said, he said, he said uh, the verse that you talking about. He pillow talking, which I can. That's see, all right? about to say. Sometimes I, I, it I can, can be a see that That's how common and Drake got into it. When, yeah, when Drake talking, talking greasy to, to Serena about him, he be pillow talking. Yeah. So it ain't even like we just saying well, do so, what you do. So now you talking about him. So when Ludacris does a pillow talk, you say who? Ludacris too. He's pillow talking about even on the lower scale guys. There go. He know for that shit though. On the lower scale guys, y'all got to stop pillow talking, man. That Drake, shit. you got to stop pillow talking. See, so maybe that's what it is about. That shit what it is. Niggas pillow talking. Yeah. I mean, that would piss me off too. You feel me? Hey, why you pillow talking? Yeah, that shit is that shit is insane. But um, you should never bring up another think, another man when talking I to think, a female. Yeah. So you you y'all really don't think J Cole should put Drake in the smoke because because you getting Kendrick? Wait, say that one time. You think he shouldn't put J Drake in the diss record? Who? J Cole. What's you say he's been talking he's greasy, doing? but because he's been saying, I'm the best, I'm the best. Drake just went oh, yeah. on stage and said, ain't nobody fucking with me. Yeah. Can we stop this no, I hear kumbaya you. shit like they not saying they are all jocking those three guys. Johnny I mean, you can say, spot. you can be cool and yeah. say, I'm just hypothetically. We always joke about being best point guards. I'm going to say I'm the best point guard. He going to say you're the best point guard. I'm gonna say somebody can't like, fuck with me. I, he go, I, I think it'd be deeper than that though. Bring now, back if, push it, now if it's up. personal, then oh, yeah, they're like bless, bring yeah. back the push a T point. Push a T stepped out of that whole Kanye. Stop fucking with Kanye because of that shit with him and Drake. Mm -hmm. Like y'all, is y'all cool or right. not? Both y'all act like some bitches. bitches so. yeah. <laughs> but you right. bitches in the industry, motherfuckers be picking sides. A lot of motherfuckers yeah. act like bitches in the industry. But yeah. I, I feel like you how it is. How right. Cole been talking? If you really want to separate yourself from these guys, right. you just can't. All right, I got Kendrick out here. That make me the best. That's why I said you just said Drake ain't he ain't fucking with Drake. So you gotta you have to like include that dude. And y'all like, yeah. genuinely cool. I don't know if they're genuinely cool, but if you genuinely cool with Amaya, and we we both think we that dude. But I ain't gonna even say if we, if we genuinely cool, 
I don't want nobody being better than me. That's just me. That's that's what I'm saying. So I, if we could be cool, you I, can't, I'm a, we gonna find a way to separate ourselves. You can be cool and still, yeah, like free in competition. competition. Nah, yeah, still okay. taking subliminal shots. Okay, each other but to stop <laughs> claiming a one, number one spot when you ain't even trying to separate yourself from that nigga. When you going on tours with him, when y'all hop on tracks and say, "Yeah, we the illest." Okay, we so the I want to. That's what I want to get to. That's what Don't I say. Doing that. So that's what I want to get to. That's why I think the real. Beef is between Cole and Kendrick on this who's the best lyrical MC shit because they not trying to be number one like Drake. Drake making records these dudes ain't making. So if we really want to go off that, Drake really is number one. Like, I really think like it's Kendrick Mike and Cole. Jackson. Yeah, Drake is Mike saying? Jack, you feel me? He yeah. gonna sell, he and, gonna I, and that's the Mike Jack line. Number one. Like, like Mike Jack was the popular, popular, but Prince was like the, the super musician, could play all the instruments and stuff. He's more the musical guy. So, so if Drake... No, if Kendrick beats Drake in this, if Ken, Drake replies is fire, we say, damn, Kendrick come back and whoever wins out, where do we place Kendrick? Even though he doesn't put out the most music like these guys, yeah. where do you herald him at, at this, as far as his number one talk? I got future number one. Oh. Wait, <laughs> wait, 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 wait. That. It's different levels though. So I got Kendrick. Oh, I, got See, I got Kendrick with Cole and Benny Nell. You do political. You do political. Drew. You do the political. Yeah, Drew. Okay. Okay. I'm trying to get you to see right. Drew. Who the best? It ain't right. no. I got you. We could, I got you right now. The best <laughs> overall numbers and all that. J Cole. Who making the, the best songs? The worldly songs. I'm in the club. I'm hearing J Cole. What? You hear J Cole in the club? Cause he what? jumping all, he, he be on all day. Yeah. He be on a couple things. What we talk? Come on, man. We ain't finna do Drake like he ain't in the club, bro. You said Drake or J Cole? No, I said Drake. You said, you said J Cole. Cause look, I said J Cole. My yeah, bad. I said Drake. Yeah, my bad. Drake is number one. Drake is number one. You said now J. Cole. as far as MCs, <laughs> niggas who spitting got got ooh, Conway and Sauce Walker. They my favorite right now for right. niggas that spitting. Now see, look, I get that talk, but that's the fifteen percent. Yeah. This battle has hit the 85, dumb, deaf, and the blind. Yeah. Everybody's looking now. Yeah. It ain't shit to hide. It ain't no lines to decipher. Like, yeah. is he talking about him? No, Kendrick said, yeah. I'm talking about y'all niggas in yeah. the whole world. No right so now it's, so like, now it's, it's like on Drake the stage, is one A, bro. Kendrick it's on the main B, stage. And then now. J. Cole second. That's we can like, have this. We can have this. I can't even say Kendrick. Who? I can't even say J. Cole. How it is? It's like Drake is one A, Kendrick one B, and then they got I can't even say that. I'm not. I think no, Kendrick, I'm just no. saying. From, I think Kendrick been knocked to the third in the public. Uh, that's why Kendrick. I think his, he's been knocked to the third crazy. too. J Cole went crazy last year, bro, and we can't deny. So he, he went, went crazy. So I'm, I'm not saying. saying. All of that. I'm not his saying. features <laughs> hit harder than, than um, Kendrick's album. But to answer that, I'm I'm he's put future, he's, I put Future he, out of all of them. But this my thing today. But this my thing. This my thing for J Cole. Y'all saying that? That's a trash. Every time this cuss Kendrick come, he wait. This is the response he get. You're not getting that response when J. Cole drop. I'm just saying. When Kendrick come out and drop some shit, look at the response he get. Like he's like you can say back then, we, we used to wait on the whole verse and mm -hmm. the response he'll get. I can't say that. J. Cole. I'm not saying that. I think Mom's J. Cole. Wild, Mom's got whole videos breaking down J. Cole's I get that, but bro. I'm saying, look yeah. at okay, but look at the response right now that you what are we talking about? Kendrick. We talked about we J. Cole. About all three of them. I know that, but the response kicked off because of Kendrick. Yeah, yeah, true. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> That's what but, I'm saying. But I'm just saying, J. Cole versus guy. I get what you're saying. I'm not I, I no, like the Listen, though. No, listen what I'm saying. saying. I don't like J. Cole no, no, is I, killing. I, I agree with that. When Let Kendrick drops the verse, it's only certain, even though you might hate Niggas it. It's certain rappers, shit. Eminem, Hole, Kendrick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That when we wait for them verse, we waiting for them verses. It's it's like a thing. That's all I'm saying. So let me ask you something. If J. Cole took a little break, you think niggas would anticipate him the same way? Cause it's the way no. his style is. I think, I'm just asking. I think me personally, no. If Kendrick or J. Cole lose a lyrical battle, it'll hurt them. If it Drake hurt. lose, it don't hurt them because he from the you just go to the club and hear him. Yeah. You're not going to the club just hearing Kendrick and they gotta they gotta hold their hat on being a lyrical nigga. Yeah, Drake they, don't. They they pride themselves on <laughs> that's it. That's what I'm that's what I mean. It's really Drake versus I mean Kendrick versus Cole. And, and Drake what, can lose and he's still that nigga. And, and Drew, I'm an understanding of that. But what first person shooter did, it brought that's not even you see how when hold dudes up. hold on Mo, no, when dudes good. try to separate themselves on tracks it ain't no fun ass party record it's mm -hmm. some like a uh, a beat like a, a decent ass beat and you gonna rhyme mm -hmm. they having fun on it which made everybody hear that record yeah they put a video behind it yeah and they called themselves like yeah, <clears throat> we the best we the best and they made everybody see it so even though drake be in them clubs he still put himself in that lane yeah in that conversation so 
Now you got the guy that Kendrick, he, boom, I shot at you. Fuck y'all. It's time now. Right. You can't, yeah, you make the club hits, but you in this lane, and yeah. it ain't like you ran from being in this lane. Right. You jumped in that lane with J. Cole. Right. With, with Kendrick. Right. You got on that mic on that stage and said, ain't nobody fucking he with did, me. But he did the same shit with me. Like, he ain't uh, right, uh, coming. Was, he ain't new to the battle. That's what I think. Hold up. No, that's what I'm saying. But, I think he and, might cook. And he's, he's not new he, to the battle, but if he would have lost to Meek, Drake still would have been nah, Drake. Yeah, uh, Meek I, I, ain't I Meek no more you, after that battle. Why is right. Drake getting past? But also, but don't forget, in that battle, I feel like Drake lost something too, but he just not getting it back when he lost, when he found out niggas was Right, why does Drake get lost? He started to try to pull the point. I hate to say it. It's a LeBron shit. I don't think he would have tried other shit without Meek Exposed to him. It's a LeBron. Why Drake, Drake losses get overlooked? How he get passes? I'm, you just said Drew's point. Well, I don't think he don't have he to, look. Good he just said Drake can lose good, and they don't bother. It's gonna shadow. It's gonna overshadow all of that. Hold his head on being a lyrical. He's still gonna That's the problem. Shit, Why? Why? He should. It's like because he because got the power. He got the power of the eighty five percent. No, he got the power of the eighty five percent. He got the. He got the fans. He got the. I ain't disagreeing. What you saying? I'm talking about the sport of hip hop just being competitive. Right. Why is it when he loses, he gets a pass? I think I got the perfect answer for you, because the people who talk about this shit once again. It's just a 15%, and that's where it only matters. But Drake where, lives general, on that, though. He takes advantage of that. He gets a loss, and it's like, all right. But yeah. if Meek, look, 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 because, what, again, Meek almost made, lost his career off of Drake. Because, music, because, but, because Drake is, 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 it a loss, is it a loss when I lost this lyrical battle, but the club is playing my joint? No, the club ain't paying yeah. your song, so you got to hold, you holding your head on We hold no, what I'm saying, we hold rappers different. But Ja Rule. Drake is more than a rapper. I get. He's I'm not disagreeing. None yeah, of y'all said yeah, right. Ja Rule was a pop star. No, he's a, no, he he's a rapper. At that, he's a rapper. a rapper singer. He's a rapper singer. He's a rapper singer. It's, it's, okay. it's not the same. Pops, but no, no, cook. Well, but I'm just saying. Uh, they, Drake, well, everybody, Drake, everybody, everybody knew that, bro. I know Drake he made that, but everybody knew what Ja Rule. The real battle for Drake is future. Feel me? That can split the club. That can make the DJ like I'm gonna play. But that's what I'm saying. He's just getting passes. That's all I'm saying. That's the battle of the club. I don't think he's getting passes. I don't think he's getting passes. Niggas know he got slapped by Diddy. I don't think he get. But he came. And what happened? We laughed at it. Exactly. Pusha T killed him. We laughed at it. And and he nothing. Came, he but, came back. Look, that's how we have my kid from the world. He lost. We still the, talk about Jay Z losing. We still yeah. talk about Ja Rule. He lost to Pusha T, but he ain't. But Pusha T ain't got the club like he. Do. I get the club. He got the, I'm not disagreeing with none of y'all saying. I'm just saying. what I get. I'm not disagreeing with y'all saying. But he's getting passes. Y'all giving him passes. But we telling you, Fifty Cent crushed him. It's a difference. No, 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 no. Nobody crushed Drake. But not only that. We love Ja Rule. Who crushed music. him? He just lost. Murder Inc. went down that when Murder yeah, Inc. Yeah, when Murder Inc. got that court case, case he was shot to kill off. That fucked him up. Jay Z really get messed him Jay Z get a pass. Good, yeah. All them dudes, Jada Kiss was killing him. He got a pass. How was the king of New York rocking Jim sandals Jones. with jeans? Jim Jones and them. Thank you. They killed Jay Z and he got a pass. Stop! 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 What? Let me talk. He fought back. And he lost. No! 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 Getting getting Meek Mill. Out of here Bro. and fighting back is two totally no, different. If Jim things. Jones had the social media back then, that it was. We, if, if, if. Bro, I'm just saying. Back every battle, whether he lost or not. He fought back. We you can fight back, but Jay still gave us the But he what I'm saying. Right. Jay You can fight back, but you still lost. Okay, he didn't get knocked out. He lost He lost but by the. Because he's Jay Z. He's not going to knock punch count. But look. Look, to what you're saying about Jay Z, that's why he bounced back. He lost to Nas, but made 03 Bonnie and Clyde. Excuse me, miss. Change clothes. Shit, I think he had Right, right, right. I got my mojo back, baby. Right, we talk, right. I know that, what I'm saying. He lost though. We still got TV people J. that be fighting. It's still people that don't even think he lost or eat. That's all I'm saying. That's cool. I, I, but I know. I'm, See? I'm, I'm one of those. Thank you. That's my point. I like. I, I like the track. Thank I was you. Just I'm sorry, Jay, but you was getting chased in Thank your building. You. It's people <laughs> that don't think these people be losing. That's my whole point. I mean, it was. A, it That's was my whole point. Lost number anywhere. <laughs> Jim Jones and it was cooking Jay, man. <laughs> He get passes. Oh, sorry, I got How was the king? These dudes get passes, man. Hey, it's a LeBron shit. LeBron lost because it's that bull. It's that LeBron shit. I hear you, but they get passes, bro. But I, okay, to your home. point, Mook, and to what the point I'm making, it's it's because they way right. too high now. Because they popularity so, so big. So I think right. if he lose now to a guy, people didn't don't mess with Pusha T. Don't care for Pusha T like that. They fuck with Kendrick, so him losing to those guys might be more polarizing and might hit harder. I'm still gonna do shit to his career though. I don't think it's gonna do to nothing. Who career? Drake. 
Yeah. Ain't shit gonna hurt him. Oh, he on nah, nah. another level. Yeah. Nah. Like he said, he, 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 he always got, got the bangers. He, he got the bangers. I'm not, I, I, I disagree. I get that. His mama's like but Drake. You you I know, what it, I know that. I'm like just saying it's not fair. I don't I'm, get I'm, it. No, no, no. I'm gonna tell you why it's also fair. Every J. Cole album, I like J. Cole. I like his album, but that I understand it's not for everybody. Yeah. Nobody's sharing or mentioning any songs on his album. His last album, J. Cole. Everybody's yeah, talking about. Boring. Everybody's talking about all his. <sighs> we, can, we can get into that. Yeah. Everybody's talking about all his features, which he's talking about. He's the best. So that's we talking that's about J. Cole. Yeah. Wake me up when we done. <laughs> so yeah, that's he. it. All his songs he's known for is talking about. And he's the I'm best. A, I'm gonna say this while we on the topic. Can y'all stop? Can you and Drake's Cole and Drake? Can y'all stop grabbing these acoustic ass soft jazz beats from Conductor? Y'all didn't catch. Wind on him with them beats. Y'all heard him on West Side Gun, Rome Streets on that grimy shit. Why y'all keep getting these jazzy ass hotel spotlight <laughs> artists of the night beats and rapping over them? Quit that shit. I can tell you why. Quit doing that I shit. I can tell you why. Because it's playing in the club. <laughs> no, no, no. No, they ain't playing in the club. That shit ain't playing in the club. Hey, it be playing it's the in playlist club. era. Yep. Everybody play, doing something. It's the vibe era. Everybody <laughs> making every type of stuff to have them to have the playlist. I can't stand them weak ass beats, man. This ain't, this ain't I'm not saying I, I, I'm gonna walk back weak because conductor not weak. But damn, bro, you could have got something stronger than that. It's, if you, yo, I'm the best. With a horn and shit. Man, get the fuck up out of here. It's the playlist era. Somebody in Europe, listen to that. Man, well, this ain't for Europe. How you gonna tell them to make music for? <laughs> for everybody. Exactly. Some for you, some for so you. So don't tell me for you. Ex no, let, let, exactly let, let, let. he didn't say this for Europe. But look, back, back no, to no, the Drake point. Drake that you shit. Some dum 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 ding dum. Yeah, man, dum, dum, dum. Zero, zero, I hate zero, that shit. What you feel? You thinking of making one song that everybody like? You thinking of making one song that everybody like? You thinking of making one song that everybody, <laughs> <one song>, everybody <laughs> like? You know, song, you, I'm asking him to no, make no, everybody ain't <laughs> gonna like it. <laughs> so I'm, I'm asking him to make. That's what I'm saying. You know what it is? Certain artists now. I'm thinking my whole point. Certain artists just get passes. It's, it's just what it is. Because they're at that level, though. Yeah, Kanye. Man, because, you, because you deserve that. You I'm guilty of it. Kanye ain't deserve it. right here with a red hat right now, and I'm waiting on this next man, album. Man, look. Man, look. <laughs> the problem with a lot of people is quit making these dudes your all motherfucking heroes. Well, I'm talking about music. I'm talking about music, I'm yeah. talking everything. I, I feel like when you put them in a certain regard, you're going to have these certain expectations on them. I don't believe 100% of the rappers I listen to. Never have, never will. Believe half of what you see and none of what I you I don't know. believe none of them. So... To be thinking like, oh, man, he not real. What the fuck that do for me? We all give the other and we stay in Chicago. And you know who I'm about to say? Who? What, R. Kelly? Thank you. I, I told you R. Kelly is bulletproof. He See? Could, <laughs> but look, I That's told you this, and I'll say it again. R. Kelly could whoop, Jesus Christ could come down from the heavens. R. Kelly could whoop his ass. We still gonna listen to the music, bro. That's wild. That's you wild. not gonna listen to his music if he whoop Jesus' ass, bro. <laughs> Right, you don't listen to his music, bro. Like I'm a gigolo. Like he don't make like a whole album talking about why he had to whip Jesus' ass. Who don't listen to that? It is what it I is, bro. Say, if R. Kelly was whooping Jesus in Chicago, Jesus would be getting jumped. The motherfuckers would help. <laughs> niggas gonna be like, it'd be niggas gonna be like, yo, Kelly, what's this nigga Jesus talking about? I didn't say I would. This podcast is wild. Niggas gonna walk up. These views are not. Why you whooping? Why, what, what problem you got with This is why I'm about to go to the bathroom. Nigga, go, nigga walk up. You gonna be beefing with him? Your partner is that way. Kale fighting Jesus. <laughs> Vice Lord is gonna walk up and help Kale's, bro. That's my hope. It's certain artists they get paid. The Holy City, bro. <laughs> the Vice Lord is gonna help him. The whole 16th Street gonna help oh, him. Yes. Oh, man. Jesus Christ, he bullet proof, bro. Yeah, what is wrong? The with Bible you, or R. Kelly's discography? Pick one. <laughs> Man, <laughs> next subject. Pick I thought, one. I thought it was about the top, top niggas, man. I got Future number one. Uh, no, Drake no, number shout two. Shout out to Future album. Future uh, set Kendrick the bar number three. Album, and uh, J Cole somewhere number yeah. ten. J Cole. He, he don't even like Kendrick. He just don't like J Cole that much. So that's why he said that. He don't even like Kendrick. He's the one that put like J Cole. The damn album. Like the damn the album. The damn album was good. That's, that's hot. Fire. That's hot. Just uh, that's just hot. little. So don't say I like Kendrick because I like Dale. Bare feet, acoustic, morale, and big step is all I'm really feeling that one. The rest of that shit, you know. Yeah. 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 Disrespectful. Uh, you sound like a roach. Joe's roach in the first album. 
Who? The Peppa Butterfly? Is that the first album? No. Yeah, that, um, the first, no, first like, big album. That was the second one. The, the, the uh, first big one was, what's the name? Good Kid, Man, Man City. Man City. Good Kid, Man City. That's fire. Uh, well, he sound yeah. like a roach on most of the songs and shit. Sound like a roach. Yeah. Crazy. It's like a Joe's apartment roach. All right, now you troll. <laughs> Oh, man, you look, that's his opinion. <laughs> oh, man, you troll. I don't go to back to a lot of those records. Cool, man. You said you don't go back? Still a lot of those records on trash. Like those streets is trash. That's because you sweaty boot. Take a, take a, you uh, think so? You, you prime time sweaty boot. You think so? Yeah, I know girls. so. You like Wu-Tang What's, and shit. I love Wu-Tang, Nas, big Wu-Tang. Nas and Ziggy Marley and shit. Nas is the GOAT. What else we talking about? What's up? <laughs> Nas need to diss Jay-Z again. Yeah, you like Common too, Common. Yeah. He's soulful, sweaty boot. Y'all heard that P Rock song? Soulful, sweaty boot. You heard that P Rock song? Yeah, that shit, that, yeah, that Come on, man, stop dick, playing. Dick, yeah, you know what? Fuck sweaty boot. What up? That shit was tight. I ain't gonna even first. I wish Mace. Nah, that's who need to diss Jay Z and them again. Jay, Mason, I want to hear Mason. Oh, I want to hear Mason Cam project so bad, bro. bro. I'm they in their band right now. You already know. I want to hear Mace. I want to hear Mace rap again. Mace is a dog. You didn't hear the two joints he dropped last year? Mace is a dog. Oh, bro. Thank you. I do not want to hear no See, Mace. Stick to that no. Okay. Y'all crazy, okay. bro. See, y'all living in the moment because he on the pod. Y'all exactly. listen to all these little knucklehead you ass shorties. Y'all listen to all these knucklehead shorties. Man, listen. RB right. Thug over here. I don't, want, I don't want to hear that shit. Right. I don't want to hear no Mason. I don't want to hear no Mason. I do. I do. I want to hear that shit. I listen to Cam. Yeah, Cam. Give me a couple songs. Y'all really bugging like this? I oh, listen to Cam. I listen to Mace. I don't think they've been hearing it. Hearing they look. They we look. gonna no. We gonna play that track with Jada. I, I heard it Kent with Mace. And Mace got the I, niggas out the paint. Look, see the eighty for five. You, you the fifteen. Nobody want to hear no Mace record right now, bro. Yeah, bro. Yeah, I don't good. think he making it for the eighty five percent. To be clear, the fifteen percent don't want to hear the shit. I think we do. <laughs> shit, the five percent don't want to hear the shit. I don't want to hear no Mace. I think, track. I think we do. I think we do. Yeah, yeah, we gonna bring it back the colorful vest. Stick to the pod. You bugging, man. Yeah, man. Y'all bugging. I want to hit on me. Y'all bugging. I think I should just uh, stick we, to the pod. We got, we got anything else we covering? Uh, y'all got to watch that show, man, because y'all was, y'all was pushing back with me. That balloon show. Balloon oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You was talking about Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry, man. That girl look like Jar Jar Binks, bro. I don't know what balloon Okay, so I think. All right, so let me break it down. So the balloon show is <laughs> it's a man or a woman. <sighs> they go. On uh, they, they show. people looking for a match. Yeah. It's, it's, it'd be a roll woman or a roll man with balloons in their hand. They come out and say, "Hey, this is the single person <laughs> y'all can all pick from." And if they're not interested, pop, they pop, pop their balloon. <laughs> Got you. This girl came out built, cold. Shoes was kind of spooky. The heels was kind of spooky, but whatever. The face. It was. That's why I said, "Yeah, show me." So what bit. happened, like? They the niggas start popping them balloons, man. Okay. Was it one episode? Soon as niggas start popping the balloons. Hey, soon as dude, hey, as soon as dude walked in the room, pop, 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 pop. No, okay. The problem was, okay, yeah, my bad. I'm glad you asked yeah. me that, man. It went viral, and they was calling me. Oh, these niggas are sassy. Niggas is, uh, the the uh, they rainbows for not picking her. But a lot of people didn't even watch the whole video. I went and watched the whole video. She got picked. She got picked. One dude said, you know what? She kind of spooky in the face, but I'm a roll because the body wow. crazy. He didn't she say that. You said that for him. I said it for him. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I will say this though. I showed, I showed, I showed Brianna. She's like, that girl was kind of pop. Come on, I man. just said I have seen, I ain't seen worse. That's all I'm saying. Yo. I've seen worse, but I'm telling y'all <laughs> now, if we had grits and biscuits, and shorty in my face, I'm like, damn, she's spooky. Grits and biscuits. Spooky. Grits and biscuits. Okay. But she's going to turn biscuits. around, and you're going to see that body. You're like, yo, I'm going to take it down there. Okay. Like, hey. You saw how hey. You mentioned like grits and biscuits. You go okay. Hey, so, places you. like that, right? <laughs> I went to a comedy show. That's where you can see the realest shit ever. Comedy show, you get to see everything. Every walk to life. Yeah, yeah. Damn, every walk Everybody to life. Everybody don't care about certain shit. You seem like, oh, this motherfucker just don't care about dressing. You're uh, like, he don't care about even looking hell. Like, some people just don't yeah. care about certain shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You like, oh, this I know it's a different subject. Hey, this just you went to the comedy. <laughs> you went to the comedy show, right? Yeah. All this comedy beef. Is he funny to you? Country Wayne. Yeah. So he's um small room funny. Shout out to Country Wayne. I like his show. <laughs> fucking small room funny. <laughs> he's small room funny. I think he got the arena because of all the other stuff he did. That's it. But he is small room funny. The open the act name was Mario. He was funny as hell. He was the host, not the open the act. Yes. But Country Wayne ain't bad. He did have people laughing. I was laughing in that too. Yeah. But I just think um, I gotta see my homie because I, I didn't like I didn't, I didn't like it. I didn't like his Netflix special. It wasn't funny to me. Yeah. He got a Netflix special. See, 
You don't even know so, he got one. So the Netflix special, I didn't love that much. But in, in person, people yeah. are different, though. I go to comedy shows in person. Yeah. Some people, when I see him in person, it's hit, hit different. Yeah. When you're in the room. So you know what I went to? In the room, he's funny than he is on TV. Kevin Hart first came to the Niners Center. He was kind of funny. But then I saw, what's his name? Ash Theory in a small setting. Funniest shit ever. That was a. Uh, I uh, could imagine. Donna, was it? Donna, Donna Rollins. Rollins. Yeah. Who was funny that, who was that guy? Um, Y'all know him, man. House Party 3. He had the. He was the pimp in it. Remember Michael Collier? Michael I Collier. seen him yeah. in a small he, he room. He's from South Carolina. He he oh, he's hilarious. He was hilarious, yeah, bro. He like, hilarious. it wasn't even. It was <laughs> yeah. like. From here, yeah, yeah, to here, yeah. hilarious, bro. Yeah, he, yeah. he was funny as hell. Yeah. Chicago, so. I didn't realize with all this comedy beef, I didn't realize how many comedians are from Chicago. Yeah, yes. they say it's an epic center of on comedy. I knew, I knew it, but I, I didn't know it to that extent. I like, damn, it was, I always thought it was like big on the comedy scene. Yeah. But just, no, come um, country run. He brought all types of people, bro. I seen white people, I seen Asian people. I was like, okay, well, he got that. He got that oh. following. Yeah. Yeah. You know this com- comedy beef. He was telling uh, Goffy keep his name out of his mouth. You over. get tired of that shit out of the while. Even though, like everybody, but he didn't say nothing bad about him. He like, I thought my Godfrey was just saying like, "Yo, man, yeah, we he stop shot this up, shit. Yeah, no, Godfrey was. It was Godfrey didn't even say nothing bad. He was like, "What did country man mean when he said this?" And and Shay Shay was like, "Um, oh, he was more so talking to Face on Love, not everybody. Him and Face on Love got a beef because <laughs> Country Man was like, "Oh, if you still doing small rooms, maybe you need to change something up. If you ain't got arenas yet." Oh, Godfrey thought that was smoke for him. He thought that was smoke for anybody doing small rooms. He's like, "Oh, I do small rooms. That don't mean I'm." He's like, "We still do small rooms. This is what we love to do." And he's like, "Nah." Shay Shay was like, "Nah." If you Kevin, Sir, Kevin Hart said he still do small rooms sometimes. Just they to, all do. They just small I just small saw small Martin. Small I just saw Martin do that a small room. Yeah, yeah. that's how they. And so she, Country see, Wayne, was, yeah. Country Wayne didn't tell Godfrey to keep his name out of his mouth. Yeah, no, no, no. He was talking about Faze on Love when he said that because Faze on Love been coming Country Wayne crazy. So who who did he tell to keep his name out of his mouth? He said Godfrey. Godfrey, but so nigga, yes, no, 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 he yes. <laughs> so nigga, yes, what? <laughs> That's what we told him to keep his name out of his mouth. No, 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 yes, but he was saying all y'all. He said Godfrey and all y'all because a lot of comedians been coming to his head. Cause he got, like I said, he got a big arena kind of quick in the Godfrey, a country one. But it's a different Godfrey. era. Godfrey got him. Yeah, Godfrey. Yeah, got him. Godfrey. That's not even. But people are, I think comedians are mad at him because he he didn't do it by the old law, like right. grand out in the small in the small yeah. rooms for thirty years first yeah. type shit. Yeah, that's why phase out. That's why phase out. Long can't stand him. Yeah, I forgot what he talked about. Man, Godfrey got into it with Ti over over that. Why? Godfrey did a show, and then they was like, after the show was done, Godfrey Godfrey was the headliner. They was like, Ti gonna go up, gonna go up, and he was like, Ti, like why? I just headlined it. Ti don't do comedy. They was like, yeah, he been doing comedy. So he said something about his podcast about it. Ti called up there. And they talked about it. He was like, he's like, I'm, I'm T.I., I'll take this serious. If if if, he was if, okay, if they want to put me on stage, it's because the, the crowd wanted me. And Godfrey was like, all right, cool. You know what I'm saying? Whatever. But Godfrey kind of stood on it like, I think people, it got to be a respect. Okay, as long as Godfrey ain't bitch up. I'm just glad Godfrey ain't bitch up. He bitched up? He ain't bitch up, but he was just like, all right. He just like, all right. He thought about them goons, didn't he? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they, hey, if they come in here and steal something, <laughs> you just killed it. That, I love my full circle. Hey, that's oh, why I called them shit. niggas. That's the, that's the name of the And that's, that's why the I name called them. Yeah, like, that's why. I thought about them goons, Drew. That's why. <laughs> that's why I called that's them. That's why. You still prejudiced. Oh, <laughs> well, shout out to Ti. They say he be, he really been grinding them small rooms every night. He a comedy view. Yeah, yeah. They say he grinding it out. He ain't just Cole, trying to how, get how off his name. How, how long we got, Cole? Comedy view. We've been, been grinding for the last three years. Right. Oh yeah, okay. yeah. They go time right there. We got two minutes. We done. Oh, two minutes. We got oh, okay. We got two Min- more minutes. Minute and a half. Hey okay. man, we ain't finna go this whole part without saying something. Tell me your rap name and when you dropping something. What? <laughs> Damn. Uh, Wes Alexander. Uh, <laughs> Have a single soon. Single West, soon. Yeah, with, single with you, soon. What, is, is Drew going to produce it? I don't know. That's to be determined. Mm. What's your socials? West Alexander. Anything? Oh, uh, West Alexander on, on Facebook, Instagram. Oh, shit. Uh, look, every time, here we go. That's my Y'all doing, too. I did up, that. Bro. I did that. West Alexander <laughs> on everything. Yeah, West Alexander on um, everything. You got TikTok? They got a TikTok. I got shit. like one video. They about mm, to ban that shit. that shit. Yeah. Oh, uh, one of these damn gym stories you've been wanting me to ISO. You speaking the music? That's crazy. I um, nah, fuck that one. I want to talk about the uh, 
the the uh, the, the the stud that like me. <laughs> you got thirty seconds, bro. <laughs> Man, look, so um, what's his name? His name. <laughs> what? Pause. Pause. Hey, no, yo. Diddy. But no, yeah, she asked me. <laughs> she, I didn't know she was trying to sneak a. I'm leaving out the gym. I didn't know she was trying to sneak a picture of me. And she walked up. She was like, "Can I take a picture of you?" I was like, "Why?" She was like, "Because I'm trying to tell my friends if I were to talk to a man, you're the type of the guy I'll talk to." I was like, all right. At this point, you know she flirting. I want to say yeah. Better be, better be saying I'm trying to bring out the strap right. on you, right? Whether right. you own it or not, you know she's flirting, though, right? <laughs> You better make sure to watch out. You better she said the pronoun. She, uh, her. Hey, yo, You man. better watch out. Let me get through this story. He so said West, pull this. So go ahead, go crazy. Go crazy. Shit. Go crazy. Yeah, Yikes. So I see her again. I say, yeah. <laughs> I see her again the, the, the next day. I say, uh, what'd your friend say about the picture? She was like, yeah, they, you valid. I said, so you never talk to guys? She was like, no, I never talk to y'all, but I love y'all, though. And she could tell I was like trying to see, figure it out, and then she just walked, start walking off, start blessing the shit. I don't, I don't think I'm gonna pursue, yeah, I'm, I ain't gonna pursue that. I ain't say pursue it, yeah. but just Manny Fresh. Yeah. <laughs> no, nah, Kid Boo. You know she the Kid Boo looking. It, it's like Manny Fresh. <laughs> what the heck is Kid? It's Kid. It's a Dragon Ball Z reference. Gotcha. She like Kid. They the studs to me to look like Jada Kiss, Manny Fresh, or Kid Jesus Boo. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Nah, I, I, you, you be like WNBA oh, type shit. point guard type shit. Oh. Yeah, I need that one. Yeah, I need that one. What was that one Dwight Howard was talking to? Yeah. It's, Her. Dwight Howard was talking the, to a the, man. The dog skin man. Yeah, yeah, no, no way. Hey, hey, that was look. crazy. <laughs> what no, she talking to? Yeah, a point no guard? Diddy, Dwight man. Howard. Say no Diddy, man. Dwight Howard had a real woman. Woo. Not the other shit yeah, here, too. Watch out. Um, with that, the Cooper, that man like Bucci. That, no, we. Uh, uh, how about this? We just not using no Dwight Howard reference. Yeah, that was What's bad. another bad? That was, was another bad. bad. That was the coldest one I could think of. Nah, and it just so happened to be attached to that man. Damn, that was Dwight bad. Howard like Bucci. The white she, Diddy. She played for the Sparks though. I know you're talking about Boy, Tia, Tia Cooper. Tia Cooper. Tia. That's her. That's a Tia Cooper. Tia Cooper. Per. Okay. <laughs> Hey Dwight. Hey girl. <laughs> Lord have mercy. Episode twenty two. That was episode oh, twenty two. Oh my god. Um, hope y'all enjoyed it and stop asking us to be on the fucking show if you don't promote this fucking show. Thank you. Take a message. <laughs> that man said Dwight. 